<laughs> Alrighty. So, last time. So, upon entering Calthaberry Castle, uh, you came face to face with the Green Knight Spirit, Calthaberry. Uh, you informed Calthaberry of what had transpired on the island the last few days. And the, that the Green Dragon had finally revealed her hand. Um, the king was dead. And that you all, unfortunately, lost a member of your group. And that the queen herself was attacking <laughs> Rotra. Uh, Calteberry was also told that Rotra is in possession of the finality circuit connected to the Fleece of Lifeblood. Laura and Kellogg both tried to communicate with the queen through magic. Uh, Laura was given a very brief and short answer. However, Kellogg was told that Rotra was still alive and that many soldiers were lost in the fight with her. Calteberry asked that you all... Um, if you would like to take a rest here in the guild hall, or would you, or basically what were your plans moving forward, you all decided to decline and keep moving forward towards the Seagull's Reach. Uh, upon arriving at the shore, the Seagull's Reach was docked just off the northern shore. Uh, Demovin was trying to run the ship the best he could, but he was very happy to see the rest of you. Uh, Dimavin uh, was ready to leave as soon as possible and kind of brushes off the news of Fluke after the word of the dr after being told that there was a dragon on the island. Uh, Dimavin also was introduced to Kellogg and about about that time a smaller boat came alongside um, with Orion at the helm and Dimavin told uh, informs you that the ship. Uh, kind of talks in its sleep, and it's bothering him, and it makes whale noises. Uh, Laura uh, was very excited to try to see her cat, but uh, could not find him anywhere. And in place where the cat normally sleeps, on Laura's pillow, a note was found from Madame Sylvie. We ate your cat. Where she requests that Laura return to Winvern immediately with the hopes of being part of her family once again. Toxic mom. Orion was very persistent in going toward the island off the coast of Xanareth, named the Coral Refuge. Here, Orion had been instructed by his god to bring himself and his allies. There were rumors about, the, about this mysterious island uh, that many ships and sailors have gone missing. However, the island is the only lighthouse in the Termon Sea because of the jagged rocks and reef between the coast of Xanareth and the island. After a few days of sailing north, west from the Spring Islands towards the Coral Refuge, uh, you had some really good weather and smooth sailing. However, the ship was attacked by some merfolk rogues seeking profit and fortune. They quickly boarded the boat, demanded the ship. However, Captain Gohan refused and released a shot at the merfolk, causing the ship to become a battlefield. After some quick thinking and maneuvers, the ship was able to clear all invaders but one rogue was allowed to leave with his life. During the evening's rest, Orion and Thulna both decide to pop mushrooms for their own purposes. Orion attempted to contact his god. Orion was instructed again to bring his allies with him together, as well as all the information that he could. Thulna headed back to her home kingdom, no longer in peace, but ravaged by war, and a single dark figure standing upon a hill outside of the capital. Kellogg contacted the Queen of the Spring Islands just to report of, on his dealings with his new allies, and the Queen was very curious about Sir Evan and his purpose. The Queen also did spot the strange circlet around the arm of the dragon. After several more days of travel, the party became um, got to know their new ally, Kellogg. Uh, bonds were strengthened and information had been shared. And some questions had been answered, however, some, are, some questions are still left unanswered. But, as the sun began to go down, uh, a strange ship with a white flag, uh, with a turquoise boar's head and a crossed cutlass approached the Seagull's Reach. A ship that once was home and occupation to Gohan. And that is where we pick up this evening. So, as this ship approaches, uh, you see a really, uh, again, the ship is, it's quite large compared to your um, 
brigantine size ship. This is what would be more of the size of a galleon. Again, with three main masts, as well as two um, upper decks on top of the top, top deck um, at the bow and the stern, uh, basically towering over your ship. However, as it approaches, a single gangplank is dropped over the side of the ship, and as the ship lowers... I forgot to grab. He's not blue, but we'll use it because he has blue armor. A blue dragonborn steps out on the onto the top of the gangplank as it lowered down. Um, he's dressed in. Where's my nose? He's dressed in Sorry. <laughs> So, um, so as you see this dragonborn, um, he stands. He stands under uh, seven feet tall. He has blue scales, uh, starkly castrating, with his red studded leather etched um, with a spider work of black etchings, uh, one for each um, person that he has killed, um, and he carries. A, a spear and a and on the in one hand and has a small buckler shield in the on the other fo on his other forearm and he just kind of stands there and looks down at you and goes welcome to the grand shanty care for a ride we sure would <laughs> What? what do you say? Food is hot, drinks are cold, and we have game and sport afoot. Yes, I do. do we have fun with tobacco? Yeah, you do look like Floyd because you just Oh, got anything your heart desires. I walk on board. Sort of like the belly thing, right? It's not too dissimilar from Kellogg because it's just my voice. Um, <laughs> not too different because I just. We will board your I'm, ship. I'm the same guy. Yeah, I'm very similar. Yes. I'm the He's very confident and proud of himself. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be that guy that I suppose voices the I'm same like guy. different characters in each like the same thing. Like you meet a I, woman. I'm trying to work it up in voice for <laughs> K-Log, that's <laughs> different. Uh, and I'm teetering between Pumat Soul or just a British voice. <laughs> oh, don't you know? <laughs> it's a little different for this, but in Jordan's campaign, I'm not about to try to make that voice. You totally could, though. Oh, yes. He's gonna bring Dakota. <laughs> <laughs> this is bring Dakota Please at all. Don't hurt us. <laughs> it's not too bad, I promise. It's not difficult doing it. Kill a go pick here. It's, yeah, but I want to make it's very similar to uh, it's like crunk. <laughs> it's very similar, to crunk, <laughs> but you gotta bring up the <laughs> Canadian. Boys. Yeah, the Canadian. Don't the, oh, yeah. don't you know? Yeah. Canadian you got a bag of milk. Kiss care. Kiss care. Oi. So. Go back. <laughs> so as as you, <laughs> so as you as you all kind of start making your way onto the gangplank. Um, you notice that as you get a closer look, you notice that um, <laughs> this dragonborn also is on, only has one eye. He only has his left eye. His right eye is scarred over and closed. Um, he does not wear an eye patch. He, but he's as you as you as you approach, he goes. Eh, it's always nice to see new sailors. I'm first mate to this ship. My name's One-Eyed Leonard. You can guess why. Because your name's Leonard. Yeah. Yes. Okay. It's a good name. He's no he talking about this penis. I was going to say, like, technically. <laughs> That's right. Oh, sorry. Leeward. My bad. Leeward. I read that wrong. <laughs> because your name is Leonard. <laughs> <laughs> One-Eyed Leeward. I'm sorry. Leeward. Leeward is... I'm calling you Leonard. Leonard is a step up from Leeward. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, fine. We'll go with Leonard then. I said Leonard first. We'll go with Leonard. One-Eyed Leonard. I'm calling you Leeward now. 
<laughs> you look like you're Leeward to me. <laughs> Fine, Leeward it is, because that would make it easier when I have to tell stories. Okay. <laughs> All right, Leeward. Sounds like I just want him to be country, like Leroy. Leroy Jenkins. <laughs> oh, don't worry, you're gonna meet the other one too. <laughs> <laughs> so, as you approach the ship, though, um, I'm going to need everybody to give me perception checks, please. Do I need I advantage need from, from the crow's nest? I need to go get my dice. Okay. Are you boarding the ship, or are you... I'm, I just, you have to descend from the crow's nest, I guess. <laughs> you're yeah, right, I'd say as you're, you're crawling down, <laughs> yeah. He's still the person that goes in the crow's nest. He's putting me on that job. <laughs> <laughs> Can new character, <laughs> same purpose. Indeed. Or what was my? What was I can't believe I killed my eleven. Uh, I killed my eleven. Isaiah's character yesterday. Let me check the message again. I'm Marge. I, I, I was on character free. Marge. 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 So is he level one each time? You gonna go get no, the nice? Matt's been nice. Two. Matt's been no. nice. No. Well, level His first yeah. character he got seven kill. The second character, I gave him a good berry, and because I'm a blended druid, it was yes. poisonous. <laughs> no, I gave him a poisonous berry. All right. Okay, perception checks around. I got an 11, I got an 18. <laughs> 16. 16. Getting the dice. Oh, that one sucked. That one did. Seven. Okay. Okay, look, Dylan. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, like you're I think the uh, you failed. The heart of the failed bane is my favorite bane. <laughs> <laughs> so as you all as you all approach, um, there are several. <laughs> there are several other sailors <laughs> aboard this boat. That's one of them. Hot pie. <laughs> um, you you roughly get a good count that there are about. And I don't have enough technical minis, but there's about 30 other people that you can see that are just kind of coming in and out of the rigging. <laughs> One big. <laughs> so in and out of the rigging, they're standing. Um, and as you... Sorry. And as you approach <laughs> on the boat, um, those of you that rolled a 15 or higher. Hold on. Uh oh. Quick, quick. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Nat 20. <laughs> uh, those of you that rolled a 15 or higher uh, notice that there are also some people that don't appear to necessarily be there. Like one second they're there, then one second they're not. They're ninjas. They're ninjas. It's the quantum world. They're not ninjas. What are they? There's a what? skilled ghost, of course. <laughs> there's literally, there's a well, have you never seen a ghost? <laughs> 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 Why do you sound like Malfoy from Harry Potter? We're going. Potter. <laughs> Potter. 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 <laughs> Use textbooks? You must be a Weasley. <laughs> <laughs> Eat slugs, Malfoy! <laughs> yes. My favorite scene is when he turns into a ferret. And that's really it. Puts it in the other guy's pants. <laughs> oh, ayo. <laughs> oh, when Mad-Eye turns one again into a ferret. Yeah. Yeah. Fake Mad-Eye. Yeah, yeah, fake Mad-Eye. So pretty cool. And then He's a death eater. So, the guy who was in prison, he met. Oh, yeah, I know. I'm talking about that. He's dead. Oh, yeah, that was sad. I like that eye. So, as as you all start to walk around, um, even those of you who did not have the, you start to notice that, yeah, this ship is not just filled with regular humanoids, but there's also ghosts. There's ninjas. That roam gonna be ninjas. the halls. But they don't seem to be bothering anybody. They just kind of be to be floating around and kind of, so you see some on the bow, they're just standing there just admiring the night sky. You see um, there's a couple um, at the helm that are just kind of there. Take out my holy symbol. Do they react? N uh. They start burning and they all kill you. Oh no. Uh, here we go. No, they don't. Uh, 
They're not evil ghosts. <laughs> well, indeed, they're friendly. Yeah. Have you ever heard of Casper? <laughs> Casper, oh, who's that? Yeah, yeah is he a friend of yours? Yeah, so as you I don't even know what your new character is. <laughs> so, so, oh wait, no, you're still oh, up I'm all right. Yeah, you're yeah, saying right. he just I was like, this is your so, new character. No, he's in Ryan. Alright, so as you get as you climb he's aboard as I climb uh, aboard. Yeah. As you eventually finally make your way on board. Job on the ship? Uh, he's a mage. He's the mage now. Okay. <laughs> I don't understand why. I changed her from I don't either. <laughs> Well, I don't even want to be a pirate. I'm here with like your like, spells. <laughs> so as you as you all board this boat, after kind of getting a good look around, um, let's start poking holes a, inside the ship so he has to work on it. A female. <laughs> okay, I'm listening. <laughs> 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 I mean, she taking a spooky dude? No. <laughs> You see, you see a, you see a tiefling woman. It's almost that time of year. <laughs> it almost. Every every poo you take in October is a spooky dookie. You see a, you see a tiefling woman. Hello. Um, is she horny? Yeah, she's got cur- she's got red curly horns around the side of her head, long black hair, um, tied up in a um, side ponytail that runs back behind one of her and on the side of her, her head. Her horns are tied in the ponytail. Her ponytail is tied up in her horns. Uh, yes, you're not the mad bill blacksmith. That's cool. Grody, kind <laughs> of. Just like how mad it is it's gonna be. Uh, it's it's tied off to the side. Okay. So she I thought you meant like she had her horns here and they were just like warm. <laughs> <laughs> <That's laughs> no. It's like a deer when their velvet's coming out, so like all the blood would get matted in okay. there. Like, hey! She has her horns. Like nice her hair dreads. is parted on this side, and her po- and she has a a side ponytail on the, where her hair hangs down here and then and the knot is in front of her ear and her horns go backwards. She has red skin. Um, she is dressed in what you would assume to be a command outfit. Sorry. She's wear she's wearing a, a corset of commanding. A a jack a, yes, a com, like basically a commander's <laughs> jacket. Yeah. However, she rolls up to you. She rolls up to you. She rolls. She rolls. Because as she rolls up to you, you notice she has no legs. She's in a wheelchair. Oh. She's in a wheelchair. You're yes. having me roll up. Oh. She rolls oh, up to you. What's up? And she looks at you and goes, Well, good evening, fine travelers. Good good evening. Evening. I told her a good joke. I push her off. It. She was rolling. <laughs> Don't do that. I'd love to be your guest. I would very much like to have you as my desk. My guest. She's also dyslexic. Got it. My look with concern. Yes. My name. My name is Commander. Who's Commander? Art. Art. Artemisa. 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 <laughs> nice to me, Sam. Artemistus Falistus. Artemistus Falistus. I feel like I just cast a spell. <laughs> you may call me Commander. There's a demon now somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> and this is my vessel. I am the commanding officer on this ship. Oh, you, sure. you have just met my first mate. Well, first mate. Uh, Indeed. Oh, the ghosts, they are they are bound here. Um, you will actually see the former captain um, of this ship actually likes to hang out. Um, we had a bit of an issue before, um, but then, unfortunately, there was a bit of a mutiny, and he is no longer in charge. However, as he has come back to this, as he's come back to this realm, um, he and I have now become friends, and I'm very excited to see him back. But yes, all the... The spirits that you see on on the on the boat are friendly. They will not cause harm to you. They are of past visitors to the ship, or other lonely souls that travel this ocean that seek a place to stay. That we have many rooms. Again, as I'm sure my first mate has informed you, we have we have rooms. We have beds. We have food and drink and. You are just in time 
we are about to start some of the games. Fantastic. So we are very excited, excited. Commander uh, B system. Artemisa. Captain. Artemisa's B system. Commander. Commander, Captain. Simply, I mean, uh. <laughs> All of so, I see that you have a ship. You are more than welcome to tie it off and we can float along together. Okay. Or. <laughs> throws the anchor onto the other ship. Tie it off! That definitely would not be necessary. Oh, we didn't say it was something necessary. <laughs> necessary? Is that necessary for me to drink my own urine? <laughs> no, but sterile. No Any combination taste. of <laughs> feats. <laughs> Let's see. Was that from Dodgeball? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, I see that moral, moral episode where he, like, I had it. his wee wee was. I had the mom in my head. There we go. <laughs> 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 oh! <laughs> feats of strength, <laughs> feats of agility, <laughs> feats of constitution, <laughs> many, many games. Feats, games of chance, perhaps. We <laughs> are guests. <laughs> Uh, do you participate in any of the feats? Do I participate? Oh! <laughs> I do participate in the games. It's always fun to get involved when the crew is playing games. There, now show you my There you go, Caleb, you got it. I got it, but it's just not enough. Nice. I know, that's what I was just like. I was understanding, but I'm moving on. <laughs> I'm sorry, I need to get my stupidness out of the way. <laughs> I had no co-workers today. I had, like, one co-worker <laughs> today. It was so, great. So. <laughs> if, if you are interested, I, I will allow you to be escorted down below, and you can get acquainted with the, with the rest of our guests. I think that would be lovely. I As she kind of uh, rolls back and she ushers you towards uh, <laughs> this stairwell um, that also conveniently has a ramp next to it as well. ADA approved. Absolutely. As she goes below deck, um, you are she welcome. You are. How many sexual references are we going to make about the women in the wheelchair? That's not sexual reference. Oh, there were some pretty, or, pretty close. Or the, other, like... or the other disabled ones. Yes, I was making handicap jokes. How dare you! Because I have a you disability. Monster! <laughs> you monster! I have a disability, thank you very much. You're diabetic. <laughs> yes, my pancreas I know, is I know, inoperable. I know. I know. I'm throwing knives. <laughs> That's excuses. Oh. I'm blind. Oh. Diabetes is nothing. I can't see. Done. <laughs> I wear glasses too. Where? Where? <laughs> These are contacts. Pull them out. Look at it. Let me just scratch your corneas and try to move them eyes out. Anyway, so, so we're we go below deck. <laughs> yes, we go below deck. We go. Be very careful, guys. Whatever you do, you don't want to die. No promises. <laughs> Don't I? I just hope that I was I hoping that her first mate's name would have been Peggy, and she had a peg leg. Oh, no. Mean, He's missing an eye. No. And so, as as you what? as you roll below deck um, with the I commander... Like I have a dumb question. Yes. Why would it be a peg leg instead of, like, an actual life? Like... I, I, I mean, it sounds dumb, but why wouldn't they just put a plank we can have our fun or something like that? That's it literally what they did. They put a stick on the bottom of a wooden thing and they attached it to your leg. Yeah. Was she here? It didn't have to be pretty looking. It could have been a spindle off of a staircase. It just sounds stumpy when you say a that's, plank leg. That's literally what it was. It was a piece of wood that they attached <laughs> to another piece of wood that was a cup that attached to the bottom of your leg. <laughs> Sometimes leather. Stump. Sometimes leather. <laughs> so you could have like a bed. bedazzled like chalice with a peg leg. I'm sure that there's been peg legs that were just gold. Yeah, but. you know, for the lords, but not for the lowly pirates or people at sea or sailors. They would just, oh, you need to walk, you need to work. 
Because the sailor doesn't work, doesn't get paid. Arr, arr, you get scurvy. Mm -hmm. Well, so, you as you as you as you go below deck, um, you are welcomed to this very large uh, dining hall um, with several round tables. Basically, this ship is a floating tavern. And because of that, we are going to change the music. So. <laughs> <laughs> So, as you enter into the tavern again, you are welcomed with these. Again, the, the room, even though it is on a ship, it is only the room is only about six foot tall. Oh, my neck. Um, so, if you are above six foot, you're going to have to like, walk with a little hunch yeah. until you find a seat to sit down. And How many guests do I see? So, as you look around, um, <coughs> there's not too many um, regular patrons. There's about 15 or so. Um, regular patrons. However, the rest of the tavern is filled with ghost inspectors as they're just kind of floating around sitting, singing songs, and drinking ale, and having a merry time. I want to go play. So, as you are ushered to a table, <laughs> are you all sitting at the same table? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There's the room. Um, A. Let's see. B, C, D. One of the extra. Like, how tall was the ceiling you said? Six foot. A, B, C, D. So A, D, H, this. No, no, I said. Oh, you're crouching. Mm -hmm. Like a three quarters of a squat. So. Or one quarter um, of a squat. A. So as you as you sit down, um, you see a you see a um, gargantuous uh, dwarf uh, approach you. Gargantuous. Gargantuous. Is that a normal size person? Yeah, he's still yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry, I can't read today. Gregarious. 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 I'm actually considered a very tall dwarf. Gregorian chant. Yeah. <laughs> he's so, the only dwarf. So he comes. He comes approaching the table, and he sets his hand down, and you look, and he is missing three fingers. And he looks at you and goes, I touch his hand. <laughs> what can I get you? Ale. Ale? I don't have ale. Yeah, <laughs> I have ale! <laughs> well, I have ale. <laughs> but I have a special type of ale. I can offer you special type of drinks here on, the, uh, on this pure... Fun cruise. I can yes. offer you poor man's grog. I can <laughs> offer you slightly richer man's grog. A, co <laughs> a, co a cocktail known as the Testing Fate. It's modest grog. And the house special, the Styx Rum Mage. I want to, I want to taste fate. Fantastic. Nice claw you got there. Yeah, I lost it to a shock. Ah. Makes sense. He bit it off. Money. So they call me Shockbait Sam. It's a pleasure to meet you all. <laughs> is it an actual claw? Or is it... No, it's literally oh, just, it's two, just fingers. two fingers. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, it's a claw. <laughs> yeah, it's a claw. <laughs> it is specifically a T Rex grabby hand that he has to, he has to manually operate. <laughs> you are. <laughs> he has a hand. Yeah, it's his hand, but he's missing these three fingers. So. We'll start with drinks, and then I'll get you food. Fantastic. Yes. So, as well as the infamous Captain Fluke, I'll have the uh, your grandest drink. Fantastic. Uh. Right for the <laughs> <laughs> one one so rum mage. I would have been like super rude. I'll take like, one. I'm rum. I'll buy your cheapest shit, because that's all I'll ever drink. <laughs> <laughs> you don't happen to have a uh, tea. Oh, we need yes. tea. Maybe. Mine. <laughs> Watch his tea. <laughs> I'll have to go look. You really think ghosts drink tea? No. <laughs> Only Do the British one. I... <laughs> uh... I don't think I would have assumed they drink anything. <laughs> Nonetheless, pass through them. Grog and L. <sighs> well, you may be surprised. Alright. So I got two rums. 
I got two Ks. Uh, maybe. <laughs> what else? Well, I want to change the fate. <laughs> no. Ah! Are we paying for it? Huh? Are we paying for it? I mean, this does not for free. No, that's a restaurant. No, okay. A floating restaurant. I mean, I'm just taking orders. I'll give you a bill after. I I'm asking you to DM. <laughs> what? We we're we're in the tavern. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> <laughs> cancel, cancel that how many you. how many bars give you free stuff? <laughs> Casinos. <laughs> not the alcohol. Not the alcohol. The alcohol's not free. Alcohol the buffet? Not free. Yes. The alcohol? No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe tea. <teacher. laughs> Maybe <laughs> water. <laughs> there are some bars that allow that if you think about that. There's strip clubs that have buffets and those are free. <laughs> because daytime buffet, that's how they get their people in during the day instead of at night. All day breakfast buffets. <laughs> You got a breakfast buffet while well, someone's clapping on those cheeks. Extra salt on your eggs. <laughs> Sorry, I got oh, syrup all over really my hand. <laughs> As a cashier, you try to block out what what happens to the money when you take it from before you take it. Alright, yeah. so. Why has this got a brown stain in the <laughs> It's chocolate eating. Um, <laughs> when, I, when I worked for the city of Waynesville, the freaking water department guys, they, they, yes. said, they said they had a stack of ones that Those. they pulled out of a sewer pipe that was in the back of their truck. I'm, I kid you not. And they're yeah. like, I don't want to touch those, yeah. but I'm going to use weird. them. Oh Is <laughs> every member of your crew injured in some way? I'm yes. a doctor. Oh. I'm a doctor. Interesting. Like, the, the cook got a hook for a hand. Oh, An actual know. hook. A meat hook. We Not like mine. Meat hook, Mike, we call him. He's a good guy. I don't know how to fix that. Seems like right. sorry. <laughs> okay, so I got four drinks. <laughs> no, five so drinks. Um, no, I'm just... Yeah. She wants water. Here, make me a drink with this. Uh, do I still have the bottle of whiskey that I shared with Luke? No, you gave the whole bottle I to him. You bottle gave the whole bottle to me and I downed it. Yeah, one go. <laughs> turned into a pile of ash. Smoke. Yeah. It, uh, it was. <laughs> it yeah, was a very whiskey. smoky, good ash. Smelling ash pile. Want whiskey? A whiskey. Actually, no. It wouldn't be ash because it's poison right. breath. I will try. He doesn't know what whiskey is. It still be turned out. I know what whiskey is. It's just it's I don't just make the drinks. Yeah, I will. I gotta talk we'll to the bartender. Gold. I had yeah. so much gold. <laughs> And he he walks away. That's why I canceled my drink because I was like, I don't know. Really Look at And so as ah. um, as as he comes, oh, ah. so as he comes back, <laughs> um, he hands. Um, he hands oh, a yeah. rummage no, to, to no, Fluke. To keep it. A testing yeah, fate. Cold. To fill up, uh, two <laughs> cups of hot water to Kellogg and Laura, beef water, and he beef water, beef water, beef water, and he hands a tiny glass of a brown liquid to Sir Evan. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Congratulations, it's the cook's diarrhea. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> we don't like you. Well, I feel like there would be, there'd the be a mandatory twice. person to check if there was a... No! Oh. So, <laughs> Alright, so as... So, uh, Thulna, as yeah. you... Are you taking a, a sip or a chug? I would like a, yeah, a nice mouthful. Is that a joke? So yeah. So as you as you take a, a sip, you have the you have a very strong. A this is a very a strong potent like cocktail. Um, <laughs> it has a very uh, very nautilus smell and contains a mixture of a strong dwarven molasses spirits and a tincture of rare venomous sea urchin juice. <laughs> she, she falls in. So, are you chugging the whole thing or are you just kind of sipping it? I'm like enjoying it a little bit. Sipping on juice. Uh, I'll continue to drink it. Okay, this is kind of babying it a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Alright, so, and <laughs> Gohan, as you take a sip of your uh, six ramage, 
Rampage. I can't read. The last five minutes. <laughs> Look. Those are five minutes. <laughs> so, a few times a year, uh, Styx uh, brews a batch of his famous dark molasses spirit. Um, it's very popular. And it's, it's, it's essentially that's what you, it's a dark molasses alcohol. Oh, fantastic. I didn't quite know what you were talking about. I was like, yes. Yes. So, I will agree uh, with you. As, <laughs> uh, so, uh, as for, as for the way drinks go, um, for you, sir, a uh, bird, that's going to be, uh, three gold. Okay. For you. Mm. It's going to be two gold for you. That'll be one gold. Do I feel anything? No. It's for you, wait, 700 wait. gold. And for what the tea, you, you can have the hot water. <laughs> Could we have the pot here? Uh, maybe. I just pull out my water. I'll see. Take a drink. Just put down a giant 300 pound right. kettle and pour now, the hot water on the table. <laughs> Can I offer anybody some food? We got a wide selection. The menu includes deep sea crab cakes, a shrimp plate, rice and peas, Sam's favorite shark steaks, and giant crab. What kind of crab? I have the crab So the crab. Um, well, first I'll see what we have it. But generally, it's large chunks of an expectantly steamed crab. Um, and you get a, you get a lot, and it's, it's a lot of butter and lemon. Um, What's the butter, man? Butter. Is it, is it turned? It's not like, it's not just like that. I don't know. You gotta go ask Dick. Why does that matter? As a conscientious bird, so, like, man, do you have any uh, vegetables? Yeah, <laughs> rice and peas. Fantastic. Oh. <laughs> 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 that was. <laughs> <laughs> <Kill> doesn't know. <laughs> I'll have the same. All right, two orders of rice and peas. I'll just pull out <laughs> some rations from my bag and strip it in there. Drag. Don't pay, you leave. <laughs> no, I'm saying <laughs> customers leave. <laughs> Anything else? Just two orders of rice and peas. Uh, uncooked fish. Rice mm. and peas. Uncooked fish. <laughs> <laughs> uncooked fish. <laughs> 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 Unballed rice. Uncooked fish. That sounds good. Uncooked fish. Yes, give me a seaweed. <laughs> Got it. So do you have cucumber? So do you Slice want the so do you want the shark <laughs> uncooked, or you just want to try to get regular so fish? Awesome. All right, uncooked shark. There are some people that come in and ask for uncooked shark. Don't know why, but well, never mind. your ears make sense. All right. Same thing, but medium rare. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> <laughs> crab? No crab. Crab kick. Rice no and peas. Crab. Rice and peas. Everybody <laughs> I mean, likes rice and peas, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> the crab cakes. Crab cakes it is. What's a crab cake? It's a deep fried crab. It's like dessert. It's like a biscuit with corn. How did they deep fry stuff? Crab. We have oil and fire. It's not very safe. I want to go in there too often. <laughs> it's not as frying stuff has been around for a very long time. Yeah, you <laughs> know, I was wondering how they do. You can uh, pan fry. It. You can oh, pan yeah. fry things. Yeah. Does he like sweet stuff? You take a <laughs> cast iron skillet, like you put stuff? a little oil in it, you fry it on one side, and you just flip like it over crab. and fry like, it on the other. Like I, I'm imagining they weren't doing it with magic. I didn't know if it was like flash, you have cream cheese to flash fried, or if it was fried over like a period of time. <laughs> It was a dumb... Let's see. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Well, you may not like this. Thought. So, Six claims that he makes these Do with a traditional merman you recipe. <laughs> Given his gills, <laughs> these tasty patrons, Cheer. these are good. A good chance he's lying. One of the, uh, one of the recipes, recipes is a... Is it's a traditional merman recipe. It happened because of the T-Rex. Merfolk food. Article boy and merman. So he's, 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 he's eating that? Or no. No, he's a sea elf. 
We don't we're, like merfolk. We're different. No, I like merfolk. Merfolk are different than seals. Which which race did Jaxus not like? He didn't like himself. He doesn't I like don't himself. Race. Yeah. <laughs> he's a he's a self hater. Have you ever seen Dave Chappelle? Alright. <laughs> <Okay>. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so he, he disappears. Um, he kind of leaves you to your own devices for about 30 ish, 45 minutes as the food is prepared. Um, but um, as you kind of look around, there are several ghosts and other patrons that have kind of started to get into arm wrestling contests. As well as some of them have started to get ghosts? into some dream, yeah. huh? The ghosts. Yeah, the wrestling. ghosts are playing with other ghosts, like they're arm wrestling each other. Are they just the arms, or is the full body? It's the full body. Oh, yes, the like full a incorporeal form. No, nope. two. Nope. The full arms. astral form is sitting there. I go to help them. <laughs> <laughs> Surprisingly, you're able to grab a hold of, of the fist and move it back and forth. Oh my god. This shouldn't happen. <laughs> I'd what? like to go and converse with some of the ghostly spirits. Okay. I uh, join them. Is any of them named Dookie? No. Mm -hmm. Count Dookie. <laughs> Dookie the Boo. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> it's such a stupid joke. I know, this but is I love joke. it. Oh, if, if all of the crew members are missing, so limbs as you things, so as you approach, imagine if the ghosts are just like this one's name is Ken Doll. Like, his neck is, I'd go to the <laughs> like 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 Tell me your name. Because his appendage that he lost was his penis. <laughs> <laughs> hi guys. Hi. Some big dude. Hi. I'm Albert. Oh, we call this this <laughs> man. What? <laughs> so as you, so as you go up to what? one of the ghosts, um, they just kind of stand there, and they just like, hi, what do you want? She's like, she seems very sad compared to the rest of the part or the rest of the room. Is she a ghost? Yeah. Because <laughs> she's dead. Does she know she's a ghost? <laughs> Does she know she's a ghost? Does she take spooky dookie? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> yeah. These are questions that need to be answered. <laughs> Do you job. plan to partake in any of the games tonight? I don't know. Sometimes I just kind of sit back and watch. And I mean, I really don't know what's going on. Like, the captain was here, and then now he's not. And then he shows up, and then I show up. It's just it's very confusing. Is there a reason you haven't reached the afterlife? I think it's... Is that a, is that a rude question to ask? I, I mean, I honestly don't know. I mean, the captain and I were really good friends, and... It's, it's, it is rather strange. But it's not that we're not happy here. Don't I mean? Don't get me wrong. We're definitely happy. Just I just don't know what's going on. Cause I thought I had all the answers. My, I mean, I was, I was the captain's spiritual advisor. So you would think a person in my position would know things about the afterlife. But <laughs> I'm as confused as he is, and I'm as confused as everybody else. So this is why I stay. Imagine having to explain that, like, oh, yeah, hey, you're, with you're, uh, you're, uh, game time? I don't think we asked. What's, what's your name? I was asking questions. <laughs> uh, they call they they called me uh, Volda. Volda, what a pretty name. Ah. I was the shaman for the ship. Uh, yeah, I'll I'll probably go speak to the captain. Um, he generally hangs out near the near the wheel. And uh, I'll we we generally chat uh, before uh, before the moon gets too high in the sky and we and we disappear for the evening. Where do you guys go when you disappear? I don't know. Oh, That's where they take their spooky. <laughs> <laughs> That's <his place. laughs> do you remember? Did you die during the? Uh... Yes. It's it. Dying. The spooky duck again. The I can't remember what it's called. Mutiny. The mutiny. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> I'm not good with pirate terminology. No. I think I died sometime before. 
But it really wasn't much of a mutiny. It was just the the crew did not agree with the the, the captain anymore. He was he was a dreadful evil man. He did terrible things to people and I must And now prepare. that he is but now that he is gone moved past that and he was removed from being the captain, he's become a very more agreeable person. Which is why he and his former first mate, the commander of the ship, um, are very great friends because after he went on he seemed to realize the error of his ways. That's fantastic to hear. How's the food? <laughs> we haven't got it yet, have we? No. Is, the, food, the, the food is really good. Is the crew able to leave? The, those that are still human, yes, they are more than welcome to leave any time. We're kind of trapped here on the boat. I mean, it's not a terrible living. That's good. Do you want one? I don't know. I get to see my friends every day. It's kind of nice. Okay. Do you know why your souls get trapped on this boat? Honestly, I don't know. I mean, I remember something about the former captor saying something about his hat. And there's something to do with the feather in his hat. But I don't know. He kind of kept everything to himself. Hmm. He Indeed he did. Oh. I mean, he does. The leans on over like... Oh. It's a little <coughs> oddly suspicious. Not suspicious? No, no. Not at all. Have we met before, Birdman? Uh, no. Maybe I, uh... Oh, water. ...seen the ship before. Well, we do Once dock twice, a lot of places. And Are you a possibility? Go, uh, fluke. Go fluke. Yeah. Go fluke. Tom fluke. <laughs> yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Good. Can't our, our captain feeling weary? Yes, we. So about that Just time, uh, Shark Shark Bite <laughs> Sam comes back to the table and he goes, "I got your food if you want it. If you don't want it, I mean, it's gonna be kind of disappointing because I'm still gonna have to ask you to pay for it, even if you don't want it." But okay. and he just kind of drops it on the table. No, oh, I definitely want it. Ka -ka. Thank you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's everything that you asked for. It's your uncooked star, uh, shark. <laughs> <laughs> Yours is cooked to a medium-esque type. They just guessed it. Yeah. <laughs> I they still have like the done, skin like <laughs> on, on the outside? No, it's it's a finely filleted piece of meat. Is it like a... It's like, like a, a filet of shark. Oh. That would have been cool. Fin soup would have been neat. <laughs> <laughs> I just imagine. Hey, let me. There, I will read the <laughs> Sam's <laughs> favorite That's shark whole, steaks. Whole, Here we go. So, just, um, yeah. let's see. The shark oh, there we go. So thick <laughs> barbecued cuts of fish <laughs> served alongside roasted potatoes <laughs> and seaweed <laughs> coleslaw. Wow. Jimmy, that sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> on scale of one oh, read, to ten, read the, the descriptions on the menu, <laughs> and that's what we'll do. Uh, it yes. is uh, brown rice and. <laughs> brown pew. <laughs> All brown. <laughs> All yellow. Some warm brown. So I would like some warm brown. Candy so, peas. And the rice and peas. <laughs> um, filling dish served with hollowed out. It's ho it's served in a hollowed out coconut shell. It's a warm Ooh. stew of rice, kidney beans, and uh, shrimp, spiced with oh, hot geez, chili, and served with slices of lime. Dang. Oh, Come on, butchers make way to see some shrimp. <laughs> so you. I'm gonna look at you and be like, "Are you no. not gonna need that?" No. Read the crab cakes. What if I eat the? Oh shrimp? yes. Please? Deep sea crab cakes. Where are you, please, is that? So you just please. Yeah. All over <laughs> to you. <laughs> So given, well, so he grills these tasty no. pastries. Oh, these are good. No. He's not lying. He hasn't saw patrons from wolfing down order after order. So they're crab cakes. So they're crab cakes. I start eating. They're <laughs> Red Ross Red Lobster crab cakes. So think so like a so like a. 
cor- it's like a cornbread <laughs> biscuit with lobster and with a with like... crab in it. <sighs> So like, they're like, so they're little cake, they're like little biscuits with crab meat inside. And that is the good The recipes with was just jumbled Yeah. It's super good with it. I want crab cakes now. Well, okay. I want food. food. <laughs> 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 crab is expensive. It's not as expensive as gas. I opened my bag. That, that is true. Well, you can't put crab cakes in your car. That's not how it works. I lost my appetite. It just won't work anymore. So for the for the for the shark steak, it's gonna be six gold. It has shrimp in it. He eats shrimp. He's vegan. Who is? Kellogg. Wait, you didn't order that though. I did. I ordered rice and peas, and he lists off the ingredients. Can you remove the shrimp? Stuart lost his appetite. He's one of those. You're cultured. So, <laughs> so the so the He's shark steaks are gonna be six gold. The, the rice and peas is I'm two gold. Not upset. Two gold. <laughs> and the you know crab what? and the crab cakes are three gold. <laughs> How much was the rice and peas? Huh? How two. much was the rice and peas? Two. two. How much was the steaks? Six. Uh, I'm bougie. Thank you. No so three, three for the crab cakes. Okay. <coughs> well, I'm done purchasing for the night. <laughs> I'm not that picky. I will can, you, can you win money at these games if you play on the ship? Sometimes. Sometimes. It just depends. I excuse you. No. No. Sometimes no. the men are willing to. Sometimes they're not. Foodie. It just depends. However, why are you interested in a game? No, I'm interested yes. in a menu game. <laughs> so what type of game would suit your fancy? All of the <laughs> Do you have any games of wisdom? Anything to use Chess. your mind? Yes, it's called brain fillet. Take your brains out and we roll it. Whoever's world's father wins. That is uh... bowling. Drops <laughs> 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 backwards. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, he kind of looks at you and goes, "I think you're in the wrong profession if you're looking for mind games. Uh, Most of these men are strong. They're not too smart. I'm strong. I mean." I find myself to be something of a genius. I fought shock and lived. Wait, only impressive. three. I lost my three fingers, but I still lived. It was like a cookie cutter shark. It was like a, like the size of his forearm. I didn't say how big the shark was, but you know, you don't have to ruin the story. No. I'm, I'm, I'm talking Girl. out of character. I'm, I'm, You're I'm taking out of character. it with character. I suppose I will participate in games. I'm not much of a strong man myself. Yeah. I'm curious. I'm, the captain mentioned that there are games tonight. What's the uh, itinerary? We got. We <laughs> got. Fish. We got arm wrestling. <laughs> Just toss the yeah. ocean. <laughs> we got. We got arm wrestling. Uh, stowing the sails. Uh, reaching the rigging. Uh, pull up the sails and tie the lines. <laughs> They're just making you steer the ship. <laughs> does uh, only sound like well, the, the up with same that game. task. <laughs> Loop <of> the other <laughs> ship. <laughs> the ship. Swab the deck. Well, yeah, someone's <laughs> gotta do it. <laughs> we'll stab your but we eye. see who does it the <laughs> fastest. And, and the bestest. Sounds and like Eric, for to winning to such a game. Every last day of the month we play Mutiny. I'm sure the captain might be willing to part with some of the ship's treasure, right? Not much, but you never know. Sometimes the commander is very generous. And sometimes she gets tired and goes to bed. Sounds depressed. <laughs> or she's just tired. I mean, I would be tired too, rolling around all day. <laughs> I just want the biscuit to play in the background. Roll it, roll it, roll it. 
<laughs> Say chanted wheelchair. <laughs> yes. Okay, can't you, uh... Yeah, now she's rolling around can't you things. animate objects? <laughs> animate her wheelchair. <laughs> it to can I talk to your wheelchair for 24 board. hours? You can have an arm wrestling <laughs> contest with a commander and be like, um, I don't want treasure if I win, I want your wheelchair. <laughs> Let's see. I need that girl's wheelchair. <laughs> I need that guy's eye. Oh my. <laughs> the guy who boarded us on this ship, like, no, it's my last one. So, is anybody interested in participating in any of the games? Uh, probably one of strength for me. Most of them are strength. I'll give arm wrestling my best shot. But I'm afraid of old man, so I'm about to be careful. I'll do <laughs> arm wrestling as well. <laughs> Me too. Just start levitating, praying. All right. So, um, I'm in plate mails. So, a so <laughs> within a little bit, um, the arm wrestling contest yeah, we, seems to start. <laughs> the tables are moved off to the side. They set up the long tables so down the rest. middle, putting two <laughs> chairs on opposite sides of each, oh, and the funny twist. And they look. And Sam kind of looks at the, at, at the crowd and goes, All right, oh here's how the games work. It's be best cool? two out of three. If you win, you keep going. If you lose, you're out. Oh, sounds like a fair deal. Pretty simple game. Oh. Ah! Can, I talk, can I talk to Chef real quick? Do we keep tossing a gold into try. the pot? I'm going to go to Chef. Okay. Andrew, can I tell you my idea I just had? Nope. No. no. Can we wait? I, I guess. Is this... Uh, yeah. We're um, trying to do a lot. What game is this? Arm wrestling. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Kill love joints. Alright, so who's playing arm wrestling? What this hook? Different. Alright. And then you're going to the kitchen? Yes. Okay. Alright, so... Er, so, we'll... Microphone. So... Use this. We'll do this. <laughs> just kidding. It's short. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I'm. Um, right. Okay, so the four of you. Alright, so are you gonna face each other or are you gonna try to find a random person? I'll start with a random person. Okay. Yeah, so random matches. Okay. Random. random. I don't feel confident to okay. face those two yet. Um, as you kind of look down the table, <laughs> um, there are. Um, Ryan's not a strength man. There are uh, five participants <laughs> already lined up. Uh, sitting down, in addition to you, and okay. one of them is the commander. Yes. Uh, commander. Yeah. yeah. Captain. <laughs> shall, I face, shall I face you? If that's what you would like. Sounds like a deal. All right, so Ryan sits down at one, or at the commander, the other three of you sit down around him, and one person just stands there with his arm like, Sam's like, you win this round all by yourself. He's like, yeah. I thought there was eight people. No. There was five people, including the four of you. That's nine. Nine. Four. Oh, four plus one, four. Eight, three, four. I'm dumb. Sorry. Nine. I know I'm missing three fingers, but I'm pretty sure that's nine. <laughs> one, two, three, like four. That's right. Our count. Our count. One, two, three, four, count five, and then five. one, two, Three, four, say, nine. I got it, nine. I can see you count. All right. He's a genius. Now, That's it. Who's <laughs> 12? So, as you walk into uh, the kitchen, yeah. um, you, so based on who you thought was in the kitchen, based on how uh, Shark Bite Sam talked about um, sticks, um, you walk in and you find a um, rather oddly dressed um, female uh, tabaxi who's um, in the kitchen she's kind of wheeling and dealing as fast as she can with all the pots and pans trying to clean everything up moving things around and she's like she looks at you and goes uh, can you make this quick I got a lot of work to do yes could you make that uh, rice and peas without the meat please I'll pay you 10 gold for it Sure. Thanks. I'll help you clean. That would be much appreciated. Cool. Keep the ten gold off. <laughs> cool. All right. Have a clean. All right. So you head into the kitchen. All right. So, as the rest of you sit down, 
Okay, so I will need everybody to give me strength check. A check. A strength check. Not saves. Checks. I did question. Yes. Is magic allowed? You can try. Mm. Mm. I need them. <laughs> the answer is no. Or you're like, or you're like you try to. I'm going to cast command. Oh, give up. <laughs> oh, on your guy? <laughs> oh, that's better than what I was going to do. I was going to really hurt someone. Uh, Shock and grasp. 16. No. <laughs> <laughs> how, how, no, how he was like, want to lose, and lose is the... Yeah. <laughs> he looks at you and goes like, No. I want to win! <laughs> okay, totally As to be expected. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so is it plus strength modifier? Respect. Yes, yeah, so that's plus your basic strength modifier. Respectfully. Respect. You are strong. Okay, I'm going to cast. What? Can I cast something too? You can try. Oh gosh. I want to try and cast. Er, I have a, I have a 21 on trade. Cast suggestion. Okay. I suggest you lose. I was going to do that then, but I was like, just come here. It might be easier. Okay, hey, what's your suggestion? <laughs> I suggest you do it. Oh, you're going to. Let's just you kill yourself. Oh, sorry. That's not how you get story. I suggest I know that's how it works, but that's you back out of the competition. Judge, he's cheating. <laughs> he's just burning all of your spell slots to win. Judge! You congratulate 19. Him. You get two oh, gold dang, yeah, <laughs> for nine. winning. <laughs> no, the commander looks to you and goes, I win these every night, son. Ooh. So she also commands. All right, so um, so everybody is gonna roll their strength check, and then I'm gonna roll as we go around. So Jordan, you and I are gonna roll for first round. Oh, wait, so okay. So you it's rollies. Yeah, we're the Whoa. highest number wins the first round. I got 21. Okay, well I'm doing it one at a time. Uh, Let's go around. Do I have to re-roll? Seven. No, you keep your number. Okay. What? Chill. Okay, you win your first round. Wait, wait, wait. I wasn't facing you. No, no, I, I, so I rolled before you asked us to roll. I didn't know if you wanted to. I, I, I said a strength check. Mm-hmm. You rolled. Those two won to cast magic spells, so your roll still counts because I did ask before they started casting okay, spells. Okay, so then that was a 13. Yes, you beat my nat one. You win the first round. Okay. <laughs> All right, sorry. Orion versus the commander. What'd you roll? I'm fine. 18, she wins. Dang First it. round. 21. Oh. Breaks your arm. He loses. Woo! I should have guessed. 20. He rolled a 16. Uh-huh. All right, so. Everybody won the first Dang. round except for Orion. All right, second round! Uh, Remember, it's best two out of three. All right, everybody strength check again. Uh, who am I facing? Random guy. Okay. The same random guy. It's best, oh, okay. it's best two out of three. Yeah. Oh, best two out of three? Best two out of three. Yes, I still have a chance. Nine. All right, so for going around the circle again. Fourteen. All right, so you defeated him. You rolled an eight. Sixteen. And against Orion, you beat her that time. Yes. Nine. How dare you? She's a woman. You will advance to the next round. Woo! And Johan. Eight. You lose that round. (laughs) (laughs) It does not work like it used to. All right, so I have two advancing (laughs) to the next round. I have two still arm wrestling. All right, so Orion and the commander. Oh, I need to roll again. Strength check, yep. 14? You beat her. Yes! She rolled a 5 plus 4. You beat her literally. Plus 4. <laughs> How's it feel beating up a and cripple? And then I'm going to extend my hand. A female cripple. A female cripple. Uh-huh. So you win. You win. Hey, she has more strength than her So all of you advance to the next round. <laughs> and the guy at the end of the table is like... He looks at all of you and goes like... I think I'm gonna bow out. And now it's just the four of you in the competition. You and me, Orion. She does. You and me, Orion. She is that cool. She extends. She extends her hand to you and goes. Fair game. It wasn't. Wasn't yes. really a fair game. It hundred percent was. Absolutely freaking. You keep telling yourself that, darling. Ah, she As she rolls it. away. Oh, wow. <laughs> Your arm is visibly broken. <laughs> Check right. again. <laughs> okay, so Alright. So two v so one v one, so who's facing who? I was hoping we pick. Two v two! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> are you, are you, are you, are you 
Yeah, no, no. Oh, I was just saying, Traxxas I'm jumping you're jumping. Like <laughs> unmovable rod. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, oh, but no. unmovable rod's behind my arm. <laughs> <laughs> just like in your sleeve. That reminds me of that. Oh, that'd be, oh, that'd be amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. That's Why did you have a really like weird triangle <laughs> 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 That's a fan! Dustles are huge. Alright, so I got Kellogg and Orion yeah. and Gohan and Rita so Evan. Oh, Alright, strength, strength checks, rollies! Yeah. Or to lose. Woo. Wisdom saving. <laughs> okay. 22. <laughs> 11. Huh? Alright, so Evan takes the first Love round. <laughs> you lose. <laughs> <laughs> lost the choice. Oh, Ryan, <laughs> you are compelled to lose the first match. <laughs> I was going to do a spell on you, too. <laughs> <laughs> he just said it first. Alright, round two. Okay. Shoot. Okay. Wisdom saving throw. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? That Eight. is a 14. I got a 9. 14? You failed. Oh, <laughs> I was just you lose this round. I got a 22 and a 9. Alright, so, so, <laughs> so Evan wins. Yeah. Versus Gohan. All right. I win this round. And <laughs> Kellogg and Orion are 1 and 1. Alright, last round. Last match. Fair match. Fair match. <laughs> My mind hurts. <laughs> is it going Talk to about mind games. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 16. <laughs> Three. <laughs> <laughs> I can't just fall through. Yeah, you fall with it. <laughs> I'm on the ground like, oh. All right, so. Kellogg is right. <laughs> It looks like we're down to our last two. We got the man with the... Moo Moo face? Yes, that. I didn't want to be rude, but... My since long you're, hair? Since you're, yes, there we go. <laughs> the, the green. You're very, you're very well, green. Baby. I think it looks great on. I would agree. <laughs> and the other man who is also <laughs> very plate mail. <laughs> I like your style. Green plate mail. So I just gotta ask: Is green your favorite color? No, it's purple. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> both of you. For me, yes. Because it's a lot of green for both of you. That's so much green. That's why he became that knight because they were green. <laughs> yep. He could have went to sense. any other knight school, but I want to be the one with Wait, the green hold on. one. Green knights? We get mascot color. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I'm a teal knight. <laughs> 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 no. so, all right. Okay. So <laughs> this is my all right. Bonus, the platypus. Rollies. <laughs> strength checks. Rollies. Unless Rollies. shenanigans Rollies. is happening. <laughs> nope. <laughs> no shenanigans. Just straight. Twenty. <laughs> <laughs> Six. <laughs> <laughs> Rabbit takes the first round. Hey. Wisdom. <laughs> Wisdom. Wisdom <saves> <laughs> what are you casting? You don't have to know. <laughs> okay. I think I feel that. What'd you get? Low. What's low? Oh. What's uh, I got a oh. seven. I got a seven. Yeah, no, you fell. Want to lose this round? <laughs> no. Too bad. Uh, too, too bad. bad. <laughs> you, feel, you feel this? On. You feel this? Compulsive. Is that a charm? No. Uh. Ooh. Let me figure it out. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> yes, I'm pretty sure it is. So no, it's an enchantment. First level enchantments enchantment. are charms. No, they're not. There's a difference between it says the spell. It doesn't say charm. The creature. spell has to be char. It's it. The, literally, it will say the spell charms a creature. Yeah. It does. There's no charm in it. Because mm. the spells will say the creature becomes charmed. Because it's command, right? Yeah. Yeah. See, it it is the single action, mine, which the single action If I did moves. mine, it, you would be immune. Because I yeah. do suggestions. Yeah, because it would say, because it says the target yeah. must succeed on a wisdom saving throw or follow the command to his next turn. It doesn't say the fallen creature is charmed. Because, like, suggestion says See, you charm... The creature to do a certain action. I just have suggestions. So no, he's yeah. basically just commanding you to do something. <laughs> Which was loose. <laughs> I also have resistance versus spells. So yeah, so you'd have advantage. How do you have resistance versus spells? <laughs> it's Wait, all spells? Aura. Oh wait, hold on. Just all spells? I'm not sure. Against saving throws, yeah. Hold on. Let me let me see this. No, that Broken. was. I thought that was your plus to whenever they did. I get some. No, I have a plus spells. two aura, and then I have a another aura that I haven't used. I haven't. Really use. Let me go to it. Paladin. Gosh dang it, Wiki. Which oath are you? Um, Ancients, right? Mm. Let's see. 
Because it's your sixth level During ability, right? Or your seventh? <laughs> seventh level ability. Okay, so beginning at <laughs> seventh, ancient magic lies heavily within you. What? You and a friendly creature within ten feet of you have damage. resistance to damage from spells. So yeah, so you take half damage on spells. So if you fail, yeah, you take half sense. damage, yeah. and if you succeed, you take no damage from AoE so, spell effects. So round two goes to me. Yep. So now you are one and one. Do I know I'm charmed? You're not You're charmed. Do You're I know charmed. I was suggested? No, because it was a command. He just said lose, and you said, okay. I don't know that. You know that you lost. No. You know that you lost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stop. He commanded you to lose, and you said, okay. I'm not metagaming. I'm, I'm trying to ask. I'm telling you, Do you, you, no. You, you don't know if magic is used right. on you? Not at that point, no, because he just said lose, and you said, okay. No, because you failed Strangely, the wisdom save. Like if you lose. succeeded the wisdom, you would know he was trying to get. He was trying to command you with a spell. But since okay. you failed it, no, you have no idea what happened. You just, you just said, "Oh, yeah, I'll lose. Sounds good," and you did it. Okay. He was very, very persuasive. Are you a prideful character? Yes. 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 <laughs> but I, I, I'm just asking a question. No, you have no clue. According to the rule of the spell, you have no idea. Okay. Surrender Interestingly, lost. it does also never say the creature knows if it fails. It just, it doesn't work. Oh, well, there yeah. you go. So you have no idea whether he was casting a spell or not. You just know that you were compelled to lose when he okay. asked you to lose. So you lose. You lose. Good day, sir. You felt you would... You, you basically did... You did a... You did a... a what was it? What's it called? You did a... You did a... You did a... You did a like it, oh, gosh. <laughs> Caleb may know what it is. In Super Smash Bros, when you're playing and you're in the when you have more stocks than a your homie guy, stock. a homie stock, a yeah, homie stock. yeah, you, ho yeah, you basically <laughs> homie stocked him. He, he literally said, Caleb, that's you jumped like, off the map and stock. said, yeah. and said, yep, all right, we got each one stocked. Let's do this. So you homie stocked him okay. that round. There we go. Thank you. I was like, I couldn't remember what the term was called. Children. All right. So <laughs> last round. Children. Saving throw. <laughs> Okay. Oh. <laughs> Over twenty. <laughs> okay. Do I know I was hit with magic? No, you just you're just you just you yeah. just go like I'm not gonna lose to you. I didn't last oh. round. <laughs> you just consider Nat twenty. <laughs> it's it's a twenty two, but not twenty. Okay. Yeah. All right, and Kellogg wins the. The arm wrestling contest. He would hey. stand up, but he can't. <laughs> he's very exhausted. No, 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 no. Now you should get excited and go, whoa, your head goes through the floor, just staring into a room. Oh. It's not that strong. <laughs> I'm just and there are cheers and claps and going, yay! yay. And now we're on the It was a great game. It was fun. And. <laughs> for such a great show of sports. Uh, <laughs> there was no great sportsmanship. It was a great show of sports. No one knows. knows. No one knows. We we loved it. I shook no everyone's no hand I faced. No okay. one is going to know. Win or <laughs> They're going to know. <laughs> That's the thing. The commander reaches. <laughs> They're going to know. Evan will shake her head. I will not shake your head. Uh, <laughs> Your underhanded <laughs> tactics, Archer, has made him angry. Well, no, because I mean you. I know, no, because I've played enough with Archer to know that he will argue the fact it doesn't say this. It, it doesn't. doesn't say this. It, if it, I would think that magic is visible. Okay, we can. It's a vocal. We can argue a, rules yeah. later. Shh. The requirements is vocal. We're in That's the game. You're sorry, Evan. You're not Jordan. You can argue rules later. Don't be a rules lawyer right now. So, anyways, You're a rules lawyer. now no, the commander reaches lawyer. into her back pocket. She grabs two pouches. She tosses one to Kellogg. She tosses one to Evan. Kellogg in the purse is five gold coins. <laughs> Evan, yeah. there are three gold coins in yours. Okay, hey, I've got my dinner back. Yeah. <laughs> so. So while you're in the kitchen, um, the tabaxi just kind of looks at you and goes, Kicking off. Dope. Wow. <laughs> So what's your name? Oh, my name's Thorne. He's nuts. Shut up. Thorne. He's 
second. <laughs> no, just don't know. They call me Gracie. Oh. Gracie. This is my name. And, uh, yeah. I've been working on the ship for a few years now. Been the, the cook of this ship. Been working pretty hard. And just kind of enjoying my time. It's very nice well, to see a friendly face. Before. Always, always see Sam in here, and that's about it. Nobody else comes and visits. So it's very nice to see another friendly face. Mm-hmm. You, you don't get any other <coughs> help back here? No, I'm pretty much by my own. They said that there was a a galley boy at one point in time, but I never met him. He ran off some time ago. Don't know where, don't know why, don't really care. Probably better off for him anyways. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> Okay. Nothing like me though, so. No. Don't let know something, maybe. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> I should just delete me. <laughs> we have our own ship. Oh, be careful, no ship, I know. <laughs> it was your superior one day. <laughs> <laughs> that was very nice. I hope. I hope they. Uh, they are boy. as good as, as myself. Maybe, Maybe even boy. better. Some days, yeah. Not, I remember those days. Training, apprenticing, not really knowing how to do things properly. But you try and eventually you get better. A young lad. He's learning. He learned how to cook dinosaur meat. Interesting. Yeah. And lizard soup. Fish soup. He fed a dragon. Interesting. Yeah. Definitely know if I would want to do that. Uh, we were shocked. He ate it. <laughs> Definitely sounds not like something that would be advised. He likes kicking people. <laughs> he likes to kick people and he has a gun. <laughs> Super okay. gangster. A lot of us have guns. We gotta protect does he, himself does, in this world. I don't have a gun. Do your people turn it sideways <laughs> when they <laughs> shoot? Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> shoot man, that's the first thing you do. <laughs> like, what's up? I wanna start doing it. You right. turn it sideways, you get uh, extra damage if you turn it sideways. Um, you well, I don't know if you'll be back here. Are you <laughs> mainly magic back here? Just do finger guns. <laughs> so, um, but she kind of got kind of hosted to you and while this having this conversation, cleaning pots and pans, but she's also throwing. Um, rice and peas together, but this time without I just the shrimp and cook with, like, as requested. And, like, you know, as as she's finishing up, she hands you like the bowl. And I gave her the cook in a bowl. <laughs> Thank you, you did not have to do that. Uh, and she pockets the gold uh, rather quickly. And then Underpaid, she, got it. Goes, <laughs> no one's gonna know. And then she goes, and then she goes, well, you better get out back out there with your friends. It sounds Maybe like they're having comments. a grand merry time. Sounds like it. I'm not playing now. You have a good Pretty day though. Well, and so as you, you walk out, Thulna. Yes. As I get to the door, I turn and say, "You should go out often, if you can. Do you?" I will try. Mm-hmm. Give her some. What's her full name? Is it just sticks? No, it's not sticks. Uh, you don't know. Whoa. <laughs> Tell Thuna you don't know this character. I don't know what yeah, but wait, I won't tell you. Okay. <laughs> yes, Jordan, it's Gracie. It's That's Gracie. All she said her name is Gracie. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call her. I'm gonna put her back in her. Rex. Yes, yeah, Grace. Back. Grace. Right. And then I'm gonna shorten it the next time I see her again. Just call her G. So, as you, <laughs> so as you, as you back out of the kitchen, and you turn around, you see Kellogg with his hands in the air, kind of. He's waving as he's around. kind of like bending down, like, like yeah. he doesn't care. He's very excited. actually now. How would you show your excitement of winning? Because Archer did this, but I don't know what Kellogg's doing. For he knew they were going. He cheers his way to the top. Does, does he put his hands on his on his hips like? Exactly what my character. Yeah. Is. Very content with his victory. Yes, oh, but you would have detected it. Punched you in the face, and I probably would have knocked you out. I I uh, I guess the one just realizes that you, you, you. you somehow became the victor. Why not? So Shocking she brings you some no meat in here. No meat. I take half damage. Thank you. You're welcome. It's still damage. <laughs> 
None of my kids will go hungry. And then she sits down and drinks more. <laughs> 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 You're my son. <laughs> Still babying it. Hold on, I gotta figure Actually out how to do it. Alright, then I, I will need a constitution saving throw from you, please. How old are you? I wanna ask someone how, how old is full now. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> She's in her mid 30s now. I thought she got younger. She, like, yes. She is. No. She was walk. in her 60s, I'm now she's 30. Yeah. And then she got younger again. Did no. she? No. no. <laughs> that was twice. Mm-hmm. Now she's a 19 year old and she's like, mm, that's literally I'm gonna what be I a thought. No. <laughs> I thought she was like 18. With enough courage. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I have the wisdom Jameson of a six-year-old. <laughs> and a body of a 19-year-old. Yep. Uh, con- <laughs> That's <laughs> a terrible combination. You Hi. just beat it. Sure? So as <laughs> you chug you as you chug this um, cocktail, <laughs> your stomach know. starts to churn and feel really, really, really funny. You start to get the same sensation that you did um, walk over your uh, when you were poisoned yes. on the <laughs> on the Tolder Islands. And you're just like... Oh. It's just this regurgitating, but eventually it just, you kind of shake it off and... Oh, I was going to say, she panics, like, uh uh-oh. Like, (laughs) creepy carnival music. It just Mm. says... You know what? (laughs) I think that's a fair enough request, Thomas. It just says... You're going to multiply it for me, son. Sounds like (laughs) creepy carnival, like, clowns are about to kill us. I have heard it. As I heard creepier, American Horror Story... (laughs) Turned into 20. Oh my! By, by the end of tonight. But <laughs> as the, the every night. as like, the festivities I want to be <laughs> yeah. as the festivities end, um, the commander uh, kind of rolls in and says, "All right, it's up. time to close up for the evening. Oh, it. It's late at night." What is that? Son of a gun. Son of a biscuit. Those of you who are staying, I would recommend that you find your quarters Fuck quickly. Me. <laughs> and those of you who are not staying the night, like our guests with the ship that is docked next to us, you are free to stay in our rooms at a cost, of course, unfortunately. And or you can sleep on in your own ships. However, I will say our rooms here are probably much nicer than you have. I like my dinghy. I don't mind. I don't mind my cot. Does the does the commander leave? I've got a dinghy. She That's just kind of she she stays in the tavern at the moment. Oh, but the bars like closed up. Yeah, the bars closed up. Hey. Right. And we're all called, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, alcoholic. No, 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 As I drink I my mixture. I was going to buy the commander a drink. Before. I guess I would know. She owns the alcohol. The I know, but as a friendly she'll gesture. Give you a drink. No, no, she owns the alcohol. She can get behind the bar. No, he said he wants to be flirtatious with her. I know. <laughs> she owns the alcohol. She can go behind the bar. Oh, if you ask her to go behind the bar and pull one for her. <laughs> It's like asking someone to unlock their door it's just to open the door for them. So it's like, yeah, right. yeah. Charisma. Charisma. <laughs> right. 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 <laughs> I'm not going to work tomorrow. I have to be at work at 5 a.m. and it was midnight before I was getting ready to leave. I have to be at work at 5 so, a.m. too. But so I got to get 30 minutes early. So. <laughs> I'm going to the approach the commander the okay. game and say, I know I was like, yeah, I'm calling that the bar is closed four but hours that day anyways. due to your so like, respectable and hospitality your and your showmanship in the game, I would like to buy you a drink. We don't have points. They say we can call out seven times in a year. Basically, any particular reason? Mm-hmm. Just to show my appreciation for your hospitality and your showmanship. Yeah, I think it's six months too, but they say it's not very it often you get to meet people call out all such a nice person and you just be treated. Go change it. So any of the managers will do welcome it if you're a good enough worker. So I work in like these apartments. So they well, I must say care. it is. I must say it is it is a part of my job. That's, that's how this works. Um, 
If you're if you're looking for someone to stay with this evening, <laughs> there is someone on the ship that you might be more of your fancy. Her name's Peggy. Her name's crazy. No. <laughs> no, not. It's not like that. Peggy. It's just to show my appreciation. Peggy. Peggy. Peggy, the girl with one leg. Her name is Ringer. That's not what her name is. <laughs> what? <laughs> I have one already. <laughs> Lamau. <laughs> <laughs> so, as as she, as she kind of looks at you and goes, "All right, what did you have in mind?" Well, I have ten gold, so why would you? Like? I own the boat. I also own the stock in the inventory. Why would I buy myself a drink? Again, a friendly gesture. I'm gonna buy you a drink. I'm gonna take you home with me. Sorry. In the bay. In the bay. <laughs> no, he doesn't. That's why he had to borrow. <laughs> 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 he took a loan out. So she ro- <laughs> so she rolls over to. I'm going. You know what? Name dropping. No, Roll me not. a persuasion check. Persuasion check. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Just call her Shoddy, like Shorty. <laughs> so What's going on, Shouty? Oh, <laughs> Seventeen. Is that a short joke? Because I'm in a wheelchair. Are you trying to deceive her in any right. way, or are you no. just trying to? Be he possible? wants her to accompany him. No, she's not. In the black times. Yeah, All right. She looks at you and goes, "All right." It's hard to set. <laughs> and she starts. And she starts rolling over to Me the too. bar. No. Um, <laughs> Sam is there cleaning off the bar. And he's like, he looks over and goes, he just kind of looks at you, looks at the commander, shakes his head, and walks away after he's finished cleaning up. And she goes behind the counter, reaches under for a bottle, puts it on top of the counter, and goes, Are you going to make me drink alone? And she reaches on her, grabs two glasses, puts them on, and fills both of them up. (laughs) 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 And. I heard that's not a long time, but the heck. (laughs) (laughs) And again, you just get this this rich smell of dark molasses. Uh, liqueur just come from this She's bottle of glasses. She's opening your mouth. Glasses. <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> Sorry. What's wrong with you? I see your yes. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Yes. <laughs> so what are you sh- So what are you thanking me for? Well, just a lot of the places I've been don't treat the customers this nicely. They're better it's frozen. good to <laughs> feel welcome. In the freezer. <laughs> You've never been to a tavern before. That's literally mm. their whole stick. Not good ones. <laughs> Double oh. tavern already oh. put you in a time portal. Dimensional time portal. Only been to black and white. <laughs> this one's got color! <laughs> <laughs> That's beautiful. Well, I guess to doing our jobs appropriately. And she downs it and puts the cup upside down and puts it on the bar. <laughs> she takes off the shot. <laughs> what? <laughs> you can keep your ten gold. For some reason, I like you. However, if you do cross me or cross anyone on my ship, you will not see the morning. Oh, pull your eyes out. <laughs> I promise you, I am not that kind of man. I will not cross anyone. I'm a nice guy. I sure hope not. That's what they all say. I know. <laughs> I can leave this bouncy house. And <laughs> 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 Meg, do you mind? Oh. <laughs> okay. How much is it for a room here? Because our ship do not have that fast. Uh, it'll, it'll cost you. Ironically, ten gold for the night. Ironically. That's perfect. <laughs> How much is your room? <laughs> <laughs> five hundred. Three of your five million on the drink. Yeah, I'm gonna buy a room. Connection room. 
So you actually have to head down deeper oh, into the down. ship. Yeah. So you head down deeper okay. into the ship and you find a cabin. Um, and as you open the door, it's it's got basically almost like miniature uh, rowboat uh, style bed that's kind of anchored into the wall um, with two feather pillows, um, a, a straw feathered bed with... Um, with turquoise uh, blankets and a pillory in the corner. I should have waited. And Sorry. the room is very high class compared to what you've seen at other ends, and especially better than your bunk on the Seagull's Reach. And a pillory. What's a pillory? I mean, it's just kind of meditating over the bed. What? A pillory is a place you can poop. No, a pillory is a thing you get tied to. <laughs> <laughs> usually as a torture device. All right, so usually, <laughs> usually. Oh, a pull. Oh, no, I mean, makes you stretch. Oh. No, no, no. no, that's a torture it's, thing. It's, it's a pull. It's a pull. That they you know, tie people to. Uh, the scene from really? Hunger Games, <laughs> the second movie of Hunger Games, where they tie Gale to it, and then they start beating him in the town square. You ever watch Star Wars Episode Two? <laughs> Yes. Where Padme, Obi Wan, and Anakin are tied to the thing, and they send the monsters after them. Those are technically pillories. Very big. It's basically, pillories. Just gallows a... without hanging. You are hanging by the wrist, usually, in some and form or fashion. Yeah. So much information. <laughs> Got it. All right. So Orion staying on the Grand Shanty. What's the, is everybody else heading back to the Seagulls Reach? I'm already in my dinghy. I figured you were. <laughs> Not he should go back on uh, the ship and what kind of women do uh, back to the ship. <laughs> I, I have, have a nice cozy bed. I'm taking advantage of the quiet in the tavern and just reading in there. <laughs> Actually, can I paint? Yeah. Can I paint? He <laughs> starts painting a chair. <laughs> just paint on walls. <laughs> Kill me! <laughs> I won, you lose. Huh? <laughs> I actually want to stay on the other ship. Kellogg's was here. Yeah. Alright, we'll look at it <laughs> Do you oh, use your tail like as a big a paper? No. Oh, that'd be oh, amazing. Uh, yes. <laughs> no, as yeah. children. Oh, the new shape. String of paint. Okay, so <laughs> I have Kellogg, Orion, Some and Thulma staying on the, the Grand Shanty. The rest of the group heading back to the Seagull's Reach. Yes, I no. Okay. Laura? I said to the ship. Okay, I missed it. Alright, so. The four of you return to the ship. Draxios does right. his normal thing, heading straight Excuse to his dinghy. Nice dinghy. Yeah. <laughs> what are the rest dinghy. of you doing? Okay. I'm kind of just checking the room out at first. Just looking around, seeing what there is in the room. I'm going to cover up with my dinghy. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> it's not safe. Gohan, Evan. Your safe space. Right. Right. I'm back to the ship. That's, I'm, I'm asking, what are you doing on the ship? Uh, nothing just, particular. Oh, I guess the men are getting off the ship. just on the ship. Back to our ship. No, they've been yeah. back and forth. They were participate. They were they were eating and drinking and doing everything. Uh, else. The very first. Tell them to wrap it up. Wrap it up, Timmy. Okay. So they start getting the ship for, for ready for. They one of them Lift. comes up and goes, "Are we? Are we?" Setting sail? Are we staying attached? Are we detaching? What are we doing? Stay We're attached. staying <laughs> attached to the ship because, um, you know, you still want it. There's still people on it. There's a couple people. I'm just going to retreat to the captain's quarters. Okay. Right, well, you're saying, Captain, you are the captain. And you can tell I guess we'll leaving. just. Yeah, you probably get to the captain. You, you have that authority to say. It doesn't give the order. We're, We're still tonight. attached. Right. And get us. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Right, we'll pull in the sails and just kind of morning. float. Okay. I'm just make sure so you and Caleb also um, know that. Should we should we keep a watch just in case, or are we <laughs> are we fully trusting like of the other crew? We had a good time. No bad vibes. Good night. <laughs> You're sleeping. Always be on the lookout. Oh, okay. You're on the other ship. I will oh. look up the window. Okay. What is this? Just staring at the right, yes. well, as long staring as, at the ship. As long as you're keeping watch, Captain, then that's, that's what we're going to do. High five. 
right, so the ship is prepared for the evening time. Um, the sails are pulled in, um, just to kind of like be adrift at night. All right. Okay. And so, all right. So, so you're keeping watch. Are you sleeping at all, or are you just a little bit? Okay. Are you periodically getting up to check every once in a while? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I'm going to need you to give me... Just give me a perception check. Nine. Nine. Okay. Um, So as you you look across uh, to the other boat, um, you see a series... You see see movement on the ship. Um, It's kind of hard to pick out what's exactly going on. But it looks like it's it's a group of about four or five people on deck, and they're pooping. It kind and <laughs> there seems to be like there seems that you can't really tell to see if there's like a struggle or maybe they're just there's a couple people drunk and just kind of walking around. But there's there's definitely something that's been hap- that's happening on the main deck. Let's see if this before. Do I see anything since I'm awake? Um, you can give me a perception check to see if you hear anything on the top deck. Can I do that too? I mean, are you sleeping? Fifteen. Fifteen? I'll sleep a little bit. But... Okay, well, you'd be two decks below, oh, so you okay. probably wouldn't hear it. Um, yeah, Kellogg, you hear a struggle happening on the main deck. A sh- fight struggle? or a s- Yes, a struggle <laughs> is happening on the They're main struggling deck. struggling because they really can't poop. <laughs> yeah, well, that could yeah. be one of the things. Oh, you, oh, you, get out of me! <laughs> hey, you go up and there's two guys. Uh, Kellogg sets his paintbrush aside and, um, I guess walks up the stairs cautiously, I guess. <laughs> so, as you, as you, um, walk, um, as you kind of slowly move up and you kind of look out, the entire <laughs> deck <laughs> is empty. <laughs> Except for four or five individuals, um, the one individual or two individuals that you recognize is uh, one-eyed Leeward, as well as the commander, and and a few others that you do not recognize. And um, you see this uh, Tabaxi uh, basically take the commander in one hand raise her up on the mast as the other before it light I'm gonna cast light okay right like right above them okay so <laughs> as you do that you see all of their faces turn and look directly at you again the tabaxi still holding the commander by the throat on the center mass oh, he's dead she's dead evening everyone good evening and who might you be? Well, I just want the guest to hear. Now here, needing a breath of air. I'm well, I there's sides. nothing wrong here, so no. <laughs> <laughs> I would suggest you either return to your ship or go back downstairs and go to bed. I would suggest. <laughs> you stop. <laughs> <laughs> you Ow. Whistle, you say no. Ow! His elbow got me. <laughs> Rude. Put your elbow somewhere else. That's he a casts alarm. <laughs> I'm trying to think. <laughs> ah. I cast fireball. <laughs> you're, you're on the ship. <laughs> ah. Yeah, he's very perceptive. Gonna try to take a look again. <laughs> I did cast light. I mean, at this point, if you were looking at the since this is kind of all happening at one time, yeah, no, you definitely saw a light, and you see yeah. the commander's face. Yeah, this intrigues me, so I'm gonna. I just realized we're like roommates now, because the dinghy's in the back of the boat, and that's where the captain's like, with, like <laughs> start tapping on his oh window. Uh, I'm trying to think what I want to do. Tell the ship to start. <laughs> Noises very loudly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, the boat's definitely making noises throughout the entire night. Oh. <laughs> hey. What's 
Oh, oh shit. Hey. Hypnotic pattern? Oh, so long. <laughs> so long. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Hi. It's our time of month. Give me back my hamster. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> she right. wants a baby boat. So... That, so, because that's an AOE, so an are boat. you aiming at... Centering at the mass. She wants another. Okay, so it will she hit the commander as well. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no. All right, so I'm going to roll for all of them, as well as the commander, and then... Run, up, be like, run, commander! Run. Okay. Roll, you missed one. commander! Yeah, so... Uh, let's see if they have the commotion. They have BD-14. Oh. Okay. Um, so I have two 19s. <laughs> the commander catches on fire. Like, Stop dropping! Oh, well, you know the rest. The commander got a 14 as well. well. One of the random figures failed. And then for the tabaxi... He passed. She fails. Okay, that's Ooh. a whole lot better than all of them. <laughs> yeah. so but, um, but the dragonborn kind of looks and goes, "All right, if that's the way we're gonna play it." Uh -oh. You just have to admire the lights. And he looks, <laughs> he looks at the other two that are still active. And you just goes, like lights, don't you? And goes, <laughs> like, hey, tire up. As the Tabaxi oh still kind of has her hand around the commander's throat. Because oh she's frozen. <laughs> the other two tie up the commander as he comes forward with his spear pointed directly at you. Uh, just the tip. <laughs> just the tip. <laughs> I want to try if you break something. the spear off and literally just use it as like, <coughs> the, like li the literal dip. <laughs> <laughs> this week, is it still a spear or is it a dagger at that point? Oh, right. But I think at that point if we are going to yeah. roll for initiative because he is going to try to attack you. Yep. I'm on the other ship. I'm on that ship. I know. Are you engaging since you know yes. what's <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll probably be well, it's gonna take it's up. gonna take you a round or two to get there. Yeah, uh, but you also but see it, so, you won't yeah. know anything. You're two decks below. Oh, no, yeah. 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 no, the only two that know anything that's going on are <laughs> Gohan and Fluke. Well, I'm right. outside the show. Well, well unless he says but something, I don't to care. You. I did say something to you. <laughs> I was like, let's check out that commotion. Or not Fluke, Kellogg. I All right, just gonna ignore it. Okay. Well, I think because you asked, I'll probably go. So, like, Kellogg, what'd you get? So I oh, 12. Alright, so, yep, so you technically go first in the initiative. No, you don't. How close are they? Uh, he is pr he is closing in fast. He's probably within 15 feet of you now. 15 feet. I have a yep. question. Um, are you sipping with whole actions, like, can I pull him over for him? Yes. Oh, that bird. Right. That bird is. So you okay? So you're gonna hold your action to. No, well, not as the spell or is is Eldritch Blast. I want it has the pull effect to me. Yeah. Can I pull him the ten feet? It says to me, I guess, so it doesn't go beyond. Me. Yeah. But if I sidestep. No, it will. It'll pull because it's so, like it's. Yeah, it goes ten feet past you. You're not gonna. Be, you're. I mean, if you move, then yeah, you could possibly try to pull him overboard. I'm gonna try. <laughs> okay. That's why you need the other Eldritch Blast. Unless just, you're a melee combatant. No. Nah. Yeah, you should do the other one then. Oh, it's too late. Yeah, it pushes people. Well, each I'm, time you level up as a warlock, you can change invocations. Yeah. So you can do the other one where you push people to the forceful can you're Yeah, that's what I do. That that one. <laughs> so, yeah, so, yeah, so, yeah, so you so you move over and you try to hit and and yeah, it just goes wide. But you have a second blast. I do. You take that far initiatives. Because you're not there at the moment. That is a fifteen. Out two, apparently. What? What? Fifteen. Fifteen misses. Man. Alright, what are your and Gohan's initiatives? <laughs> <laughs> We're not there, but... 20. Oh, you got a 20? Yes. What'd you get? 21! Oh, uh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> We're fast as frick! <laughs> Alright. You're not there yet. Alright, so this so point... so disappointing. At <laughs> this point, well, the Dragonborn... Two times in combat. <laughs> I at least counts as something, but it's like... Yeah, you kind of don't hit the guy. <laughs> so at this point, the dragonborn comes up, 
with his spear, and he is going to try to stab you with it. Yeah. Uh, he's going to try to stab you two times. Oh, no, sorry, three times. Woo! I read it wrong. Three times he's going to try to stab you. All right, so... All right, so lowest roll... Say low, low numbers. Ten. Okay. Ten to hit. Does not. Okay. Sixteen to hit. Yes. And seventeen to hit. Unfortunately, that's my whole life bar. (laughs) Because I am a squish. And he is a... So you are going to be taking uh, thirteen... Or no, I'll... Let's see. Yeah, no, I'll roll. I'll roll this one. It's just me and Archer. All right, so the first one, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So eleven points of piercing damage on the first hit. And and fourteen points of damage on the second hit. And he is now within five feet of you. You are engaged at this point. Okay, so going back to you. Okay. Wedding bells. <laughs> Congrats. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, I totally forgot. I have reactions for a reason. I totally forgot. Shield. What is a reaction that I can do? With the second attack, could I do a reaction? You know what? No. Ignore it. I didn't use it. I would just have to remember it for next time. Is it my turn? Yes, it is your turn. What? What? Babadoodoo. Oh my gosh. Otherwise known as the Baba Yaga. Barbadooki. Barbadooki. Yes. Spooky. Now it's spooky. All right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, this actually just straight up skills him. Um, Rothum Psychic Lance. Okay, what's that do? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bard, aren't you? No, no, you know. Because I have that same spell. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Multiple <laughs> classes can have the same spells. Yeah. What spells? I have some spells that a bard has, but my character's a warlock. Barbarian. Goodbye, Intelligence you. saving throw? I just I yep. wish I could hear what was going on. Okay. That's a nine. Oh, <laughs> 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 What is that? So, that will be 7d6 damage. Okay. Five. I wish I could hear it. So eight. I could use a new spell that I haven't used yet. Nine. Eleven. Fourteen. That's roll five. Mm-hmm. Nineteen so rolls so six. Mm-hmm. And twenty-one total. So okay. So twenty-one points of damage. Like yep. Guys. All right. Yeah, I did that wrong. Okay, so he just stands there and kind of shakes it off, and he's gonna one blow to the next. <laughs> I like you. Pineapples. And he's gonna and he's gonna take Is his spear down? back, <laughs> and he is going to try to skewer you with it. He's gonna try and skewer you. <laughs> I mean, yeah, sixteen to hit. Skewer. Yes. Okay. And so, why don't I put those away? <laughs> just because I want to use a spell. So, 12 points of piercing damage. I just want to use dimension door. Like and then I'm going to need you to give me a um, athletics or acrobatics check. It's real estate. <laughs> As he's going to try to grapple you. That is a 18 on athletics. Okay. Uh, so, you are now grappled. Oh, man. As Whoa. he grapples. Natural eighteen plus four. Uh, so he grapples you with with his other hand with his spear and he takes uh, it out and he kinda just walks over to the deck, to the edge of the deck and goes <laughs> I hope you can swim, cow man. As he pushes you off the deck. Okay. Reaction. Yep. Missy step. Okay. If I could hear this, I would wait to like dimension door right under him and just okay. pause, so like, back behind him. him. Uh, this is like yeah, <laughs> fair amount of distance. So <laughs> no, just right oh, behind yeah, him so you can feet. push him into the water. Actually, yeah, <laughs> I do like that. <laughs> <laughs> so 
hope you can <laughs> swim, whatever man you are. Mist is step right behind him <laughs> just to shove him, him off. Well, my okay. All right, so as you step <laughs> behind him, okay, so he's going to turn around, and then um, he's going to use his third attack. Aww. <laughs> he's going to take a spear, and he's going to chuck it at you. Oh. As he turns around to hit you. Chuck. Chuck Norris. He should just like. Yeah. He should just what? casually elbow. I have minus two decks. Alright. Once you <laughs> take decks as a dumpst. <laughs> because right. it's, it oh, makes you're sense. Oh, you're a cow, yeah. Yeah. Or you're a fur bold. Yeah. So that's going to be a. I should just ele- like so it's going to be 11 points of piercing damage. Back. I just sees you just okay. And just elbow. And at that, Draxios and Gohan. You are now exiting. Is bleeding. You are you are <laughs> exiting the commander's quarters, coming on the main deck, and you see these other two men who are just tying up the commander onto the thing. You see this Tabaxi just kind of frozen solid in her tracks, as well as wait, it's a concentration spell. Oh yeah. Yeah. Try to make that wisdom saving. Yep. Okay. Well, it'd be a con check or con. Yep. Uh, so what do I need to be? It'll be, because so you took 11, so it'll be, well, you took a lot. Uh, we'll just say you have to be the DC 15. DC 15? Yep, we'll say 15. Nope. All right, so they're no longer frozen. Follow the light, follow the light. Sorry. Okay, so she is actually going to be in front of Kellogg. That's the wrong one. And, <laughs> and the other two are not oh, entering. Sorry. They're too busy holding the commander. All right, but at that point, okay, Draxios and Gohan, you are walking around as you see the commander finally just like come to her senses. Not the commander, the Tabaxi come to her senses. She kind of like flicks her hand. All right, we're going to probably do this. We'll move all these guys out of the way. Who was I fighting? Was it Leonard? Want to go to a bar? Yeah. yeah okay. Leonard. Okay. So. Leonard. Uh oh. One eye, Leonard. So there's <laughs> Kellogg. Like, like, there was you. another mutiny. <laughs> that's that's what we <laughs> came across. Yeah. Alright, and what the shit? Oh, Gally boy, you. What so are you? Are you still a fluke, or no, you go on now? I took my head off. Okay. So. Alright, we'll go on. Has arrived. Alright, so you guys both come out of the captain's quarters, and you see this dragonborn that's turned around yep. and is facing um, him, as well as this uh, female tabaxi just kind of standing there. <laughs> I trust her. Uh. Alright. Where, so, where am I light to so easily? So as this all happens, she kind of looks at... Oh, uh, the dragon board and goes, This was not the plan. This was supposed to go easy. This is not supposed to be how this is supposed to go. And that's when you guys are coming out. So, what are you doing, Draxios? <laughs> okay. Are any of them really close to each other? Like friends. Um, like friends. I mean, Both that's friends. what you see. Well, where's the one that's been stabbing him? The dragon born. Okay. Well, they, you don't know who's been stabbing him. You literally just yeah. walked around and watched him. Yeah, but I'm saying, so there's only two of them? No, there's four of them, but the other two are busy holding the commander. They're tying her up to the main mast. Is she tied up? Yeah. Yes, she is tied up. And what are they doing, just standing guard on her? Yeah, they're I'm making sure the ropes are tight. Uh, uh, I'm going to see you guys something cool. I kind of want to use this spell... Uh, Where's the commander? What do the two people that are with the commander look like? The commander's like? on the main... The, no, the no middle that's one. the main mast. That's okay. the middle mast, Caleb. The middle one is where she's at. Literally, you see where the tabaxi is? So right behind her. Right behind the tabaxi. What is races the... do they look like? You have uh, two humans. Cool. So, I'm going to cast, because they're right next to each other. And you're like, hold your breath, wheels. <laughs> and I'm gonna cast watery spear on them all. <laughs> and since she's tied down, it's not gonna have any problems because she can't move. <laughs> wow. Poor soul of you. Okay. 
So I need to make a strength saving throw. Why is the sun laser? It's a 12 and a 6. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, they failed. Uh, so they are... Let's see. There's a tiger on the ship. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> there is a tiger on the ship. It's a backseat. And a Morocco. <laughs> 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 that was the sun. So they're medium, right? Like, uh, yeah, they're medium creatures. <laughs> and then, uh... Tabaxi's are medium <laughs> creatures too, right? Mm -hmm. mm, she's not. She's not? She's not. Okay. Uh, so, what's 30 feet this way? <laughs> off the ship. <laughs> I'm gonna push the spear of water 30 feet off the ship because they're restrained and let go of it. That's, yes, okay, so yes. So actually, so I forgot about the other one that's unfazed. I forgot there was five of them. Yeah, because one, two, three, yeah. So yeah, no, all three of them are now off the ship and in the water. And not, not. Oh, the captain. No, lost. not the captain. Yeah, because she's tied down. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's why I told you just had to hold her breath. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because I, I did 30 feet out, so they got some extra movement. And then I'm going to hold this. Uh, wait, how long is it? I just want to show up through a dimension door somewhere. Okay, then yeah, like that's it. Legs. Okay, here goes. So I'm just going to smirk and have been like, that was awesome. Alrighty. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay, go on. It's your turn. <laughs> All right, I'm going to step up and shoot oh, the dragon board in the back of the head. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> What up? <laughs> <laughs> night, night. Yeah. Remember me? Twenty-five. Twenty-five will get going. All right. Oh. Is that a? Bop, bop. Is he surprised? <laughs> no, he is not surprised. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's like, I saw you coming. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> terrified. <laughs> oh. Shoot a guy in the back of the head. I knew you were there. And he's like, oh, <laughs> oh, what the? Nine <laughs> Okay. He's like, ha! Ah, I liked it! Reload and fire again. Whoa, dude! 22. That hits. 15 piercing. Okay. I add some surge. Okay. 24. That hits. 16 piercing. Okay. Maybe he was calling it. 20. 20. <laughs> 11 piercing. Bless you. Kurt. No. Oh, right. <laughs> All right. Is he hurt? Uh, he's starting to get That's bloodied gross. now. Aha. Uh -huh. I think. I just like to casually live today. Oh, I didn't kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, he's start he's starting to hurt. Okay, at that um in the but according to the fainting rules, I'm not actually proud of yeah. which is pretty cool. Okay, so in the He just slumped over right. on me. <laughs> so <laughs> in <laughs> no, in this um you see um, like again because the light is just hanging sugar. over the tiger over uh the tabaxi and she cause and she just kind of moves her head over to the side and looks at the commander and then you just kind of just start to see her her body change and shift and form and she goes from this five foot ten creature to this uh, massive 13 foot tiger beast her muscles That's swell where the sound comes and from. move as her eyes just start to pulsate red as she just kind of looks oh, over she's a, she, she a druid she a demon? She's a were tiger. Oh, that's so cool. And she runs. I a were tiger. And she no, jumps. No, I don't. <laughs> and lands in front of Gohan. Do none of us wake up on board? Alone. I mean, wake up. you yeah, can. Uh, well, I would say with her jumping on the boat and her size, the boat's definitely rocking. I so don't. you can give me a perception check. Well, hello there. Can I hear the boat? Well, no. I'm... And... Yeah, I can hear that. That's a twenty. She is going to make her three. Um, <laughs> she's going to make two claw attacks and one bite attack at you, Gohan. You get bit. You're going to contract the virus. 
So oh, her, yeah. so <laughs> her first <laughs> claw attack. Yes. It's gonna be a weird go. It's gonna be a twenty-one to hit. No. Dang it. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Our chef, who was a captain and also right. a were tiger, second claw attack is to a true. 23 to hit. Dang it, no. It's Wait, hold on. What? <laughs> Bite <laughs> attack. Bite attack. That's a miss. Biter. I got wow. a bro. <laughs> That's my name. Alright. Oh. And let's see. <laughs> you went through every single one. <laughs> Right. And then she is going to use her bonus action to disengage no classes, and yeah. move over there. <laughs> Behind the direction. <laughs> like, like, All right, it is now Kellogg's turn. <laughs> oh, like to go to the, yep. no. top of the ship. <laughs> we killed all the humans for you. <laughs> it's easy. That transformation to a were tiger wouldn't have been loud, would it? Yeah, it would have been pretty loud. I got a twenty on could that I perception. Could I do a perception to see if I can? You can that? try. The yes. DC's high. You okay. can try. That's fine. Is that you? No. No. <laughs> Look at you, bro. Okay. No. It rocks the oh wait, never mind. Sorry, you were on that boat. Yes, yes. you would know. Sorry, my bad. Uh, I was thinking uh, him. Oh yeah, if it's over a twenty. Then. Yeah, it's over a twenty. Dang it. You know what else is so a yes, So yes, those are you blessed. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I only got an 18. That's a 17. Oh, 17 hits? Sucks here and there. Well, oh, my character oh, needs to be like, no, I want to do some pressure. <laughs> that's 4 damage. Okay. No, that's so you're going to like pay with your blood or something? Convenient. Or are you like just an artist? Convenient. Uh, oh my six. god, told me well, that misses. Yeah. And I'm not gonna pull him. <laughs> uh, wait, I forget because I keep on forgetting this. Bonus action magic stone. Okay. <laughs> 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 24. <laughs> oh, dang. I see this magic stone. And four damage. Okay. Such a stupid game. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Can you lift my rock? <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna run up to you, and as he does, he's gonna pick up his. He's gonna grab his spear out of the deck, and with his buckler hand, he's gonna whack you in the face. No. Don't. <laughs> that is gonna be a. I would hate that. <laughs> It's gonna be a my character, to hit. If my character could just hear this. That is dimension gonna room. be nine points of bludgeoning damage. Okay. And then I'm gonna need you to give me a strength saving through. throw. Uh, do I automatically fail if I'm down? <laughs> oh. He knocks you prone. <laughs> oh what? Oh Kellogg. You showed up at the wrong time. You should have been like, I see nothing. You know what? He's gonna look down and just for good measure, he's gonna stab you. Okay, so it's I have to see if I yeah, that's a nat twenty. Yeah. To hit. So one dead. <laughs> You're gonna be making a Oh no. Okay. <laughs> and then Don't cry. He's gonna, I'm not gonna cry, but I'll say if you cry, it's cry. gonna be just so annoying. I'm not gonna lie, if it happens. It won't be funny. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, I got two failures though. Okay, and he's gonna turn, and he's gonna look at the two of you and go. What? <laughs> if you want your friend to live, I suggest you surrender, or he dies now. I have no ties with him. I want to make. That's the thing. Like, I'm the new guy. <laughs> yeah, we picked him up off the island. I don't know why he's with us. <laughs> What do you want? Is there anything? If I could just get a, if I could just get a good, good perception check, I would dimension door behind that guy. You're, 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 you've noticed the, you've noticed a commotion, and you're starting to hear shouting, but you're still below deck at the moment, because this is all happening in six seconds. What exactly? It's gonna take you a few seconds before you get on deck. Mm -hmm. Oh, so there, he's shouting now? He's shouting across the thing. Yes. Perception. It's going to be high. Again, you're two decks below. I and mean, your deck is below the water. That's okay. Okay. Maybe my guy's really paying attention. Maybe. No, let me see my armor. I'm not perfect. 
That's my perception. Okay. You can try, Thulna. That's my perception. Hold on, I gotta check with <laughs> Oh, you're down there too, aren't you? Yeah. I doubt it's gonna work. But just for fun. I'm not gonna laugh if she does. No, she gets five. It. That'd have been hilarious. You've been trying this whole huh. time and then she gets huh. it. Mine's a six. <laughs> wow. How about you ask the real captain what she wants? The real captain? I'm the real captain. Richard. There, kitty, kitty. What do you want? <laughs> that's not a sentence I want to hear. <laughs> I want this ship. But if you're the captain, it's yours. Not yet. That doesn't make any sense. You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> bang, bang, bang. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Why are you picking on the cripple? That's right. wrong. <laughs> <laughs> that's illegal. <laughs> that's discriminatory. <laughs> That's a good I could save all you. Alright, and alright, going to Draxios. <laughs> I'd be like, why are you picking on the cripple lady? <laughs> That's what I I'm gonna ask. I'm not picking on her. She's. This is. I want the ship. And she's in the way. She dies. I get the ship. But you're not the. I will be when she's dead. There's five of you that want her dead? <laughs> You really think the entire crew is hers? Oh, they all work for me. But they also all work for her. <laughs> That's how a deception works. He laughs a lot. Treasure planet. <laughs> <laughs> Treasure planet. The. Oh, that's not. Okay. You should yeah, be like, hey, dog. Sorry. <laughs> <Get 'em. laughs> or the original book. Treasure Island. Treasure. <laughs> but I haven't read that movie, nor watched the old movie. If you watch Treasure Planet, it's the same story as Yeah, <laughs> I figured. <laughs> Except for one's in space with cyborgs and one's, one's not. One's cooler <laughs> and one's the island. <laughs> <laughs> They're both good! <laughs> they literally have the same names. The whole time it's the same name. <laughs> What's the record like see, outside? Like, I want to save your character. Nighttime. But I just want a dimension dark. door behind him. Like, There's the hey, waves don't seem to be. Doing, it, it seems to be calm seas at the moment. At the moment. Tries to hit me. <laughs> a misty step as a reaction. Just saying. If I do die, I'm gonna build a better oh, warlock. Just yeah. telling I you guys, shield. I'm just building a better warlock. I want to play warlock, but I'm building a better one. <laughs> Could I be Kellogg a second? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to replace Kellogg. <laughs> <Kellogg. laughs> <laughs> 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 What's your so name, Big brother. I think. Uh, <laughs> big, <laughs> bigger brother. She's with bigger muscles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because she wants the ship, and you're stopping her from taking the ship. Give her the ship. Part of the ship. Part of the care, I don't care about the ship. I just like the, pushing all the people off because I'm suggesting. Killing is fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Death like, is magical. Fair enough. I don't know why I'm trying to treat this. Hmm. What about those people I pushed over? Peons. I can always get more. I like you. <laughs> uh, I think I'll just hold my action until Gokhan gets hurt. Right, Where I get well, it's hurt. Gohan's turn. What if, you doing? Because that's the hurt. six seconds conversation is yeah. over. Damn. You're not gonna be killing me. You're gonna be Dimitri Green. Are you not the? Victim? I had to look up serial numbers. <laughs> <Dream. Dream. Dream. laughs> no, I'm not the captain yet. <laughs> she has to die. Look at me. I will. I want her to I am die. the now. And the ship will be mine. And its secrets will be mine. Mm. Oh, so is the like ship get an initiative? <laughs> no, the awakening ship does not get initiative. <laughs> I just wanted to go. Ooh, every once in a it while. It does that all night long. Yes. It's <laughs> <laughs> in there. Ship is making. <laughs> it does that. Stand next to him. I yeah, yeah. you. Yeah, get behind him. Shoot yeah. him in the back of the head. <laughs> so you're being hostile, I, moving, because that initiates an opportunity attack yeah, on the cat. I do. That's what you're doing. Yep. Crack. to kill Kellogg. No, I want to get between Kellogg and the uh, Jack. Where is your stuff? Being 
that's going to be a 25 to hit. Yes. He's like, yes, I can be a were-tiger. Uh-huh. Oh, no, she's hitting him with it, with her sword this time. Oh. Well. <laughs> attack. Okay, so okay. that is going to she's be... Like, you don't get the satisfaction. All right, so it's going to be 10 points of slashing damage. I also need a constitution saving throw from you. 24. 24, cool. Half damage, you're taking 12 points of acid damage. And then you are also going to be taking 21 points of extra damage. What? She has other features too when she makes a hit. Call it pimp slap. <laughs> Ow. That's I feel pain like that the moment. What are you talking about? You got... <laughs> oh, you didn't get down by the dragon, but no. you got hurt. I didn't you didn't? I didn't get hit. <laughs> Not once. Oh. Nope, just the T-Rex chomp. Uh, yeah, that hurt me. So as you're running. Yes, I'm getting between Kellogg and him. Crap. No. Okay. So confused. <laughs> I was not expecting that key. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure. He was hurt, my friend. 22. That hits. Mm-hmm. You're a mess. What? What? 16 piercing. Where'd he go? How do you want to kill him? Ah. Yes. I'm going to run up, engage him, and sort of like, uh, very slickly move behind him, <laughs> like under his arm, and pop him in the back of the head. Nice. You should do it without looking, like you slide under his arm. Okay, so yeah, so you, you fire and he falls yeah. over and dies. Just like. You and then start like stumbling up on your knees, yeah. like, oh! And with my, well, I get, no, I don't have a remaining action. Nope. Because I'm seven attack. I just be like, I attack him. Go, <laughs> get up. Yeah, it'll be. Just yeah. and try to he attack the head captain. Losing out of right. it. Or I want to be captain. All right. So she no sees one. that yeah. that yeah. you are still hostile, and she's now going to make attacks at Draxios. She's going to claw him twice and try to bite you. The first claw attack. Draxios, <laughs> the were tiger. <laughs> Aqua tiger. Seventeen points of damage. You didn't say if she hit me. That. Oh, sorry. Seventeen to hit. No. Next claw. Less than that. And finally the bite. That is going to be 19 to hit. Yep. Okay. So you're going to suffer 12 points of piercing damage. Mm -hmm. And I need you to make a constitution saving throw. You're going to be a tiger just swimming Uh, through the water. I got a 20. Okay. So you resist the curse. And as she kind of reaches in and bites you and kind of just rips her jaw out of the back of your throat, she just kind of looks over at Gohan and goes, You kill one of mine, I kill one of yours. No. No. (laughs) You can always walk away. I just wanted to mention Gohan. Wait, you don't have a way to stabilize Kellogg, do you? Common criminal? No. Medicine check, yeah. Yeah. Was it a fail? We'll find out. Okay. And he is dead. All right. Referring to Kellogg. <laughs> okay. As well as the monster turning initiative. All right, Laura, you come up and you see what's going on. Do I see Kellogg? No, you your head pops out from below deck, and you see a, a you kid. see a giant <laughs> a giant tiger humanoid standing behind Draxios, kind of like in a death stare with someone on the other boat. All right, um, so roll me initiative. Yeet. Oh, that's not good. Oh, six. Okay, Draxios, it's your turn. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, she bit me. <laughs> oh, that's an action? No, that's you entering the combat. Oh. Right. You're slow off the draw. 
coming out from so underneath the boat. I'm going to go ahead and summon Pyre on her then, since she wanted to attack me. <laughs> okay. So she has a dex save. That is a 25. And she passes. It's still 2d6 on the summon, so it's halved. Half of 5 is 2.5. Three. Three points of damage. And then... Uh, You gotta re-roll a character. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to see. I'm not gonna be able to get to you. I know. There's... I don't think I even have any like healing spells. So I wouldn't be able to do anything. Like, I could, but I have the last of a mission. Flame blade. Not one. As a bonus action. I could put you out of your misery and then in, a, in a cool fashion. Fire's in turn. Cool fashion. We're going to teleport. Okay. <laughs> so she needs another deck save. No, uh, so I might go just that one. Here inside of her. this. <laughs> squishy characters are. I rolled a one. On <laughs> four. Or you make a squishy and, and then character. we're gonna. Me and Pyre are going. Nope, that's, that's, that's not my character. character. We're gonna teleport over here. Okay. Just easy to talk about. Me. No, like, well, if I ever made another yeah, fire dogs on it's, it's magical fire. It, he only okay. ignites what he needs to. Okay. Go and on. Like yep. Go on. Alright. Yeah. I'm gonna pull out. Are, do we say that potions are um, incidentals? They're, no, you can either do after action, it's a full hail, or bonus action, you have to roll. Gosh, I'm dying. It's so hard. Wait, so actions pull. So if you do an action if you do an action to chug or give a potion, it it's max heal on the potion. Okay. But it takes your action. Or you can do it as a bonus action and then you roll the die. Oh yeah. I will bonus action <laughs> down a greater one of my greater potions. Okay. Down his throat. Forty four. Two. That's that's terrible. Three what? Another thing that I've been playing. It's one of the biggest. Five. You gain five points of heal. Do I gain five points of heal? So as you take the potion and you pour it down his throat, you see the magic start to go, Mm -hmm. and then, but Kellogg does not come back to consciousness. What the heck? You you actually? How? No. Oh Seriously. my gosh. Uh, that's funny. I was so excited post- for this character, uh, too. I was like, oh, I'm, I'm just saying it's like, I there's can still, him. There's <laughs> still a chance oh. if something else happens. Okay. Uh, okay, that was my bonus <laughs> action, so yep. I'm going to turn around and fire at Mickey. Oh, See, now you have the advantage because you have a gun and. Uh, well, we have the high ground. Yeah, she's got a lot of movement. Really? Wait, does she know I'm there? Piercing. Ah, fuck. <laughs> I have another one of your companions. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <Here we go. laughs> Drags just be like, I had your oh, attention. Wait. How much of that is piercing? How much of that is magical? Oh, okay. So. The whole thing is. Because if you get, if only the force damage is yeah, magical. Only, oh. oh, it's four. Okay. So four points of force damage. And how much was okay. the piercing damage? <laughs> what did I say? Well, that's plus. Uh, it's okay. I got. I got. I got that part. Okay. Let's. Okay. We'll go to the next one. Okay. Uh, Eighteen to hit. That will miss. Wow. All right. <laughs> that's it. All right. Okay. It is now her turn. And yeah, because Laura's technically popping her head out. Mm-hmm. And let's, I'll, well, I'll see if she notices you. She has advantage with smell. So let's see. Give me a stealth check. Got to be an 18. 12. All right. She said you stinky. So she looks <laughs> and she sees Laura. You and see she's going to turn. 
And she's mm. going to attack you three times. <laughs> Two with her claws and one with her mouth. So the first claw attack <laughs> is going to be a 23 to hit. Yeah, that'll hit. Okay, that's going Ooh, to loot. be seven points of slashing damage. You're rolling up character two, apparently. That's Jeez. also a 23 to hit. Seven so points? Another seven points of piercing, uh, slashing zero. damage, sorry. Zero. No. And then 15. the bite attack is going to be 13 to hit. Wow. No. Okay, so she misses her bite. <laughs> ha! Fuck you. <laughs> Okay. Really and then she's going to take her bonus action what? to disengage. What? And she's going to run over here. Run into the captain's quarters of your ship. All right. Catch me if you can. Okay. <laughs> Laura, it's now your turn. That <laughs> hurt. Has there been any loud noises? How far is she? Is she? Try again, Orion, after Laura's she's turn. She's closer than 60. Okay. That's good. <laughs> Hey, kitty! Can I get my dog fire sword? I suggest you go away <laughs> and run. I'm shield? commanding her to flee, basically. I she already is fleeing away from you. <laughs> flee off the whole ship. <laughs> <laughs> go over. Save your humans. I suggest you go for a swing. Alright, so she a rolled a 13. Swing. She failed. Uh-huh. However, she's going to use her legendary resistance and oh, choose to pass she was instead. A legendary. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you have burned her single legendary resistance for the day. Yeah. Bonus action. Uh, he can. He's just rolling okay. his perception. Yeah. What you do? I'm gonna give you a D8. Alright. Okay. Of inspiration. Kill the kitty. <laughs> I will. Oh. Kill the kitty. What's gotten into you? <laughs> My cat's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what's your perception? You got to. <laughs> okay, here it goes. So Three. Where's Jordan? Ah. on the couch. It's only a 19. He says his character's still asleep, so she's like, I'm just gonna wait it out. I Even like, during the battle? I don't know. She doesn't want to hear. Oh, don't care. It's only a 19. He'll figure it out later. Doing shows like pee pee poo poo. <laughs> Alright, so Draxia, you're so back to you. <laughs> ha! Really I'm just kidding, I love you. Um, <laughs> Don't throw that in that box for the archers. Yes. You know what time it is? I will. Oh, okay. It's all. I'm gonna die! Sorry. I'm gonna die! Sure <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be your barbarian like brother. 20? Hey, guys. Nope, they'll miss. In place, and then he just back him out of the chair and just let him sit him down. <laughs> It's almost like a slow motion version. <laughs> yep. 28 hits. Yes, it does. That one does hit. Okay. Uh, who, do want, who do I want to be? Stop die. So what are you hitting with? Ooh, I do My flaming know. swords that I conjured last turn. Okay. And she's going to take 11 fire damage. 11 fire damage? Yeah. What's the dog doing? What's the dog doing? Nothing. I'm vegetarian. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then... I want a grilled cheese sandwich with jalapenos inside. Alright. <laughs> 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 Alright. Let's see. That's what I sound like after eating the grilled cheese. <laughs> <coughs> I want to make a video of that, except you're a customer asking the waiter that and his response is like, <laughs> 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 I would really panic, like, can I get a grilled cheese sandwich for jalapenos? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <on> the table. <laughs> you just simply look up and be like, to, from, the, the from the dog's perspective, though. What's the dog do? <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> so. Panic Hey, what's the dog doing? 1d4. Which is 4. Plus my spellcasting modifier. Doggy, stop. Which. You're better than this. Doggy, I'm so sorry. Spellcasting modifier is. No, I think the bed attacks. It's your wisdom modifier. (laughs) Don't take that sock, Doggy. Don't take that sock. Master, why is it so. <laughs> it's moving so on its own. Plus, it originated from my dog. All you hear is just. 
<laughs> as an intro. Oh, you got that reference? Oh, sorry, sir. <laughs> you got the Nine plus eight what? is what? what? That's how much I'm healing for. Nine plus eight. <laughs> So, 17? Yeah, I'm gonna heal for 17. That's the soccer. That's more than you did. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Okay. Alright. We're playing we are in the game. middle of combat, good sir, which okay. you could possibly join because you were just sleeping below deck and there have been shaking up. There's... Do you want to see what's happening? Because they literally have been shaking the boat and there's been screaming and yelling and... People Someone dying. dying. People <laughs> dying. Yes. Ten. <laughs> no, for his side of the boat, yes. So you will join. We will make an initiative roll after Laura's check because you wake up to the sound of fighting and combat. Okay. And then it's the the dog's turn. Oh yes. I thought, I thought that's what Pyre's bonus action was. Was healing you? That no. was action. That was my bonus action. Oh, that's weird. Okay, cool. Worst ten gold I ever spent. And then Pyre's gonna go ahead and bite her. Okay. How do you like being bitten, bitch? <laughs> well, he's going to miss because he got a 15. <laughs> yep, that does miss. Alright, then she's going to take one of her legendary actions, and she's going to make a weapon attack towards Gohan. I thought she only got one. That's a resistant. These are legendary oh, actions. Oh, as I said, like, Jordan, I know they're They are different. different. No Gohan does a 26 hit. Yeah. Okay, you're going to take yeah, 10 nice. points of slashing damage, and I need you to give me a constitution saving throw. 21. Alright, so 12 points of acid damage. That's a cool sword I can't wait to steal. <laughs> Alright, it is now Gohan's turn. You're okay. hurt. <laughs> Good. I'm firing you. 22. That will just hit. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's not as bad as Jordan's. Um, 28 one to hit. Damage. Or 27 to hit. One force oh, damage. No, I looked at him and he said just hit. I'm like, so, okay, so one point and then five. The character that Jordan had in one game had a 27 to hit. It was a demon. Oh, uh, it was, was a demon. It was, yeah, it was a demon. 20. 20 misses. Business. It's that close, though. So. So I need a shotgun. <laughs> Alright, and at the end of your turn, she's going to take her, her one of her other legendary actions to attack uh, Draxios this time. That's a uh, 16 to hit, Draxios. Nope. nope. Okay. Alright, it is now her turn. Um, and she is going to... Uh, she's going to try to claw and bite Gohan. So first claw attack... Is a twenty-six. Yeah. Okay. So that's gonna be twelve points of. Oh, sorry, no, seven points of slashing damage. Second attack is gonna miss, and her bite attack is probably gonna miss as well. That's a sixteen to hit with her bite. Okay. The one thing you want to get hit by, so you can become a wear tiger. All right, Laura, it's your turn. Um. Uh. Yeah. I'm gonna hold person her. That's a plunge. She's not a person. Winston. Uh, the tiger form's gonna be Connor. What do you mean? No. That's still be vegetarian. Okay. So what is it? A vegan Winston tiger. <laughs> that is a natural one. Your nickname is yeah, California. Okay. Yeah. And she's frozen. <laughs> yep, she is. Okay, so read the condition to me again. What condition is she uh, in? Paralyzed. Person. Paralyzed. Okay, gotcha. Alright, so she is currently paralyzed. And I'm going to healing word go on. Okay. You know you have a D8, right? He didn't use it to, to try to hit. He has to do it after, or he has to do it before I say it's whether it hits or not. Technically, by rules. Yeah. But, uh, but now you know the AC, so. Yeah. You okay, bro? What the heck? What the heck? Did you just break it? Just... Yeah, the weld came undone. The what came undone? The weld. Do you want this chair? No, I'm good. Okay. We're moving on. Okay. <laughs> Nine <laughs> points of healing. We all look like he's gonna fall. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, no. The, the well I literally just... The one. I've done that before. The well literally just popped off. Hmm. Alright, moving on. Okay, so... Laura, anything else? Nope, I already did a bonus action. Alright, so she's going to use her first legendary action of this turn, and she's going to try it, and she's going to slash at Gohan with her skin card. I'm not sure. She can't. Mm. She's paralyzed. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Where are you? Ha ha ha. She's paralyzed. Hi. Huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So on her turn, yeah. see what's going on. Like, okay. Decks below them, underwater. But it's uh his the, his the role in first initiative. Yeah, yeah. So Jordan, give me your initiative, initiative roll. I wish I could hear this. Six. <laughs> Can't speak. I was speak. sleeping in my armor zone. <laughs> okay. She got a six. <laughs> yeah. I got six too. <laughs> I have a higher dex than you though. Yeah, but I went first before you, so hmm. it was her perception. I'm before yeah. you. I got sixteen. Okay. You're on the other boat though. No, I'm on, I'm on the big boat. Yeah. Yeah, no, oh, she... No, she, she wait, what's your deck? Yeah. Okay, so... Uh, 18. So what'd you roll for your Mine's initiative? What'd you Six. Roll? <laughs> they both have the same... <laughs> what's your save? Okay, roll... Well, save don't matter. Here, you were already in combat, he goes after you. Okay, so that's gonna be your... Going you to Draxxus. What you? are you, a dog? You What was that? You're like... <laughs> <laughs> no, I just heard that. Oh. <laughs> um, well, she's paralyzed, right? Yep, so all your attacks have advantage on her. Aha. I'm going to strike her with my fire sword. <laughs> it's at advantage. Where's the one? Was she asleep so, too? I just so six. her and Orion are two decks below on the Grand Shanty. They're literally under the water in the ship. Not, there's not, the ship's not flooding, but water yeah. level, they're below water level in the ship. They mm -hmm. hear nothing unless they get really, really high perception. Well, what about dinner then? <sighs> I'm just asking! Jordan. I mean, I can run four characters, Jordan, fine. Jordan. <laughs> Dim -dim don't care. Yeah, Dim -dim don't give a shit right now. <laughs> He says, Why fuck you, you guys. Why are you running four characters? I see one. <laughs> I was running multiple, but I can run NPCs, too. You would have known if you sat in here and joined the rest of us. What? 15 <laughs> fire. You didn't. Fire. <laughs> yeah, it was a 27 to hit. Well, then you should have been in the room, Jordan. You don't get to know the secrets of the Constitution if you're not in the room beside it there. Mr. William Berg. Okay. <laughs> then, no, I left because I was I was looking a little hurt. Yeah, so. and so did they. And then some of them decided to, oh, I'm going to proceed to see if that, something's happening. And then they're trying to mutiny the ship. Four and you plus. decided to leave the room. Yes, 18 seconds ago. <laughs> yeah, in game time. Call 45 minutes in real time. Nine plus, Nine plus oh, seven. Uh, you feel for 16. That's cool. And then it'll be dogs. Yep. <laughs> Healing word might mine a lot better. Yeah, I get a bonus though. Oh. My, my bonus is really high in general. And then I get a bonus when the dog's out. Oh, to my gotcha. healing spells. Well, that is expensive. that your first heal spell that wasn't on yourself? I think I've done it to. I've asked. No, you did it to Solna. Did I? She was Yeah, she was down. Yeah, I did. But she's oh, one yeah. of the people up there. Oof, I'm going to re roll that because it's cockeyed. Um, 26 to hit on that. Yep. So, I think it's... Woo. This is the first time the character... Did. Yes, this is the first time you felt Draxios' healing touch. What? <laughs> so, an additional four fire damage. Okay. Ah. <laughs> ah. Okay. No. Alrighty, it is now Gohan's turn. Sorry. <laughs> I feel invigorated. Yeah. I feel. So all your attacks have advantage. Yes. Invigorated. Yeah. Yes. I, like, I feel vigorous. Uh, for uh, a chef, a chef is invigorated. Wow. What yeah, the heck? You do realize you have well, well don't waste it on that because so. your highest was what a seven. Yeah, so so seven plus yeah. I'd have to roll six. Let's go. My name ah, is seven. Vintage. So, um, so twenty-three. Yeah. Twenty-three hits. Ah. Ah. That's amazing. Go wham. 
Isabella is not vintage. Margaret. 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 Margaret.
take her 12 points of acid damage. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Drag you. <laughs> you well, while she's far and away over there, I'm not running towards her. <laughs> um, That's a good one. I'm going to through the, through the dog. Uh, roll the poopy. I rolled an eight, a two, and a one. <laughs> I'm going to that turn. Where's it at? Where the heck is it? It's fine because I'm groggy, I guess. They're poison Minecraft games. <laughs> well, let me go to my known spells because I feel like my spell is missing that I always use. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> no, I don't use it on this character. I use it on the other one. Never mind. Um, I'm going to do produce flame, I guess. Okay. Uh, 21 does not hit. Nope. Alrighty, cool. Um, with that, you're pretty healed up. You're looking better now, aren't you? Yes. You have a party member down. Who? Kellogg. I think he rushed me down. Yeah, but he greater healing dumped potion. a healing potion in his face while I was there. Yeah. <laughs> That did nothing. Uh, just saying. Oh, so like a healing word ain't gonna do nothing? Not this round. I'm just saying. You have options. And then, yeah, I don't have anything that I'm gonna do with my bonus action. Except tell Pyro he, very, very <laughs> close to hitting, please. And he's gonna attack. How's he attacking? Spitting fire. Oh, okay. He's spitting all these rhymes. That's a, uh... 32 to hit. Yeah, that hits. <laughs> Baskin Robin Take is four damage, because I rolled a one. Baskin Robin <laughs> is making Why is my tea? dog's spell attack higher than mine? I feel I like mine's messed up. It probably is. Anyway. It shouldn't be higher than mine. Okay. Um, she's starting to look a little hurt, but she's going to take her, she's going to take her legendary action, and she's going to strike at Sir Evan again. I think that one misses, though, but let's see, that's a, that's a, no, that's a 21 to hit. 21 hits. I'm sure we can so 10 back. points of slashing damage. Con save. And a con save. That's funny. Con save is a 17. Alright, you take no points of acid damage. Mm. Alright. <laughs> now go, Han's turn. Alrighty. Yep. Uh, back to the shooting. Back to the shooting. <laughs> back to the game. <laughs> 17. Now one. Oh, 20 to hit? Yeah. That's a miss. Yeah, they're both to it. Yeah, they both they miss. Both miss. Okay. All right. It is now her turn. Um, she's gonna turn back to Laura. Fuck you. And she's gonna take two claws and a bite. So the first claw attack is going to be twenty-one. Just kidding. Okay, so that's going to be seven points of slashing damage. Second attack is uh thirteen to hit. Nope. Okay, and then the bite attack is less than 10. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, and then she's going to bonus action disengage. She's going to run over here. Okay. <laughs> I like it. Alright, and it is now Laura's turn. You see that she ran away from me. I guess I'm lucky. <laughs> Alright, I want. I'm gonna try and do shatter, but I've got a ten foot radius. You will hit Draxios and go on. If you center it on her, or you have a chance of destroying the ship. Oh, never mind. 
Stop oh. blowing holes in me ship! Stop blowing holes in me friends! <laughs> <laughs> okay then! <laughs> I'll do vicious mockery then. Your mom, yay! <laughs> sorry. Nine! Nope, sorry. Twelve! Your mom's gay. <laughs> Seven. Oh. Seven points of second damage. What's the other thing that Vicious Mockery does? Look at the spell. Yeah, she has disadvantage on the next attack roll makes before the end of its next turn. Yep. So she's going to use one of her legendary actions. She's going to strike her scimitar at dawn. Disadvantage. That's 18 to hit. No. Dang. Okay. I'm just going to delete the finality circlet out of my... Uh, Inventory? Alright, it is Evan's turn! He's pooping. I love a pee. <laughs> Ryan, do you want to see if you can? Yes. Alright, reception, right? Yep. But it's gay. Okay. Okay. What? 18? 19. <laughs> you start to hear stirrings. <laughs> I'm gonna approach the bar area, see if that's where it is. Yep, so no, you head up, you leave and you start heading up and you notice and you look around and nothing's going on in the tavern, so you make your way up towards the main deck. So we'll get you in a second. Evan. I stab her twice in the left Oh crap. Okay, how far is that? She is 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Okay. Yep, yeah, she's 30 feet away exactly. I stab. Okay. That ruins my death. Miss. What do I need to get? 22. Alright, I miss. Crap. Alright, legendary action. She's gonna strike at. Oh, everyone um, within 10 feet of me has the resistance and the uh, plus 2. So, to Gohan, mm -hmm. that is a 34 to hit. <laughs> so, 10 points of slashing damage with her sword, mm -hmm. and then you need a con save. Plus two. Plus Aha. Does he get the resistance? Yes. Yes. 17. Okay, so you pass, so you take no acid damage. Okay. Wow. Alright. <laughs> I'm helping! I'm the plus two. Alright. In the process of... Orion, you run so you up you out two? of the... And... I need you to give me an initiative, please. Initiative. Initiative. <laughs> Seven. Initiative. Initiative. He just shows up here like, hey, we're shut up. <laughs> All right. Okay, Traxios. What the? Oh. Okay. I thought the curl was a spider. Well, I was like, I I okay, <laughs> I'm going to swing at her with my scimitar. Okay. Fire one. Throw hands. <laughs> Why did you have to roll? I know, I saw it. I saw it. Uh, I missed. So I was sad. And then. What? <laughs> I'm going to. Rude. I guess. You don't miss. care. How no. bad are you looking? Um, uh, I can't believe Bad. A little bad. Pretty huh. bad. I guess I'll heal him again. Aha. Uh -huh. You're the same hit points as I am. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Plus six. Heal for 15. Yeah. <coughs> Pyre doing something? Yeah, he's just gonna bite her. Okay. Bite her in the ass. Uh. <laughs> he's gonna miss. Uh, gonna miss. Right. All right, go on. You missed that dump uh -huh. truck. <laughs> I like it. So advantage on your first yep. hit. Yep. Crap. Ah, so close. One up. Yeah. Twenty-seven though. That hit. How's it going? How's it going? Two fours. Fifteen piercing. Crap. Get out of my 
check. <laughs> Just in the background. Right? Twenty-three. That hits. Man, ah. this is so cool. rolling really bad. No. Except for my healing. Hate piercing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Then she is going You're to take her. Uh, other legendary action. <laughs> a fleetless of foot, and she's going to move. Okay. Can I Not taking that? opportunity attack. Ow. Going back to Laura. What? Nope. And she is going Wah. then moving to oh, wait, do I get an opportunity? No. no. Fleetless Pay foot. Attention. She moves without invoking opportunity attacks. Yeah. Now she's going to make attention. her three attacks against Laura. Ow. Two with a claw, one with a bite. So the first claw attack is a natural 19 to hit. So that is going, <laughs> that's that's going, to, that. that's going to be seven <laughs> points of slashing damage. Second attack. 14 to hit. Okay. And then the fight attack is going to miss. You said a miss? You have an AC of what? 17? Oh, my lord. Why is your AC so high? She has the amulet. Oh, yeah. Armor. I was supposed to be a 16. It's supposed to be a 16? Yeah. Why well, do you have a 7? The amulet. The amulet, the amulet oh. gives her a plus 1. Okay. Orion, you walk up to just see Kellogg on the ground, <laughs> dead, unconscious. <laughs> you see everybody else just kind of waylaying on this monstrous humanoid tiger, as then she's just running around from ship to ship in a furious movement as you kind of pop your head up. And you see the, the captain tied up. I'm going to go and untie the captain. Okay. That will be your action if you do that. Yeah. So, yep, so you go ahead and start untying the captain. Or the commander, I should say. Commander, yeah. Okay. You have terrible crewmates. Bonus action. I did it. <laughs> she. She. I, I made a mistake, okay? Alright, Laura, it's your turn. Walk her wisely. Well, fuck. But, but, babe. Oh, actually, before your turn, she's gonna hit you with her sky. <laughs> <laughs> That's a 17 like, hit. Ow. Yeah. 10 points of slashing damage. You downed? Almost. Constitution saving throw. Fuck. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> 16. 12 points of acid damage. I'm down. Wow. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Rerolling character All right. sheet and now. All right, and Laura's... Okay. So far. Alright, that's Laura's turn. Evan. Alright, go back. Oh, I'm doing the same thing. I'm just gonna. <laughs> thump, 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 thump. <laughs> you have plus two and resistance to magical damage. Too bad she's down. Oh, yeah, that's right. She has a chance to hit you while she's down on her legendary. Yep, that's gonna hit. Wait, what? She's taking her legendary action as you move to stab Laura. Okay. Your turn. She stabbed Laura with her legendary action. Oh, as I say, like. <laughs> that is not one that you 22. got. 22! That just hits. And. Doesn't hit. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> so, I have seen enough! <laughs> Spell slots galore! Go into the smite! <laughs> <Barely>. <laughs> Every spell slot. Well, uh, considering she took me down to half damage, she's downed her, and then uh, him. Uh, well, again, I don't, I don't know context other than giant tiger attacking people, you and killing to, your friends. You don't have to reason it; you just got to. <laughs> <laughs> the context is your friends are dying. Giant tiger is killing them. So, no, no, no mercy. <laughs> stabbing magical javelin into her back, pumping spell slots into her back. Okay. Yeah, so. Pumping. Yeah, pump it. Bussin. Pump it. Pump it. Pump the jam. Hold on. Is it bussin? Bussin. Bussin. So, we'll do uh, Thunder Smite as a bonus action. Okay. And then we're doing. Thunder Smite. Um, three level two spell slots. Okay. Here, let me, ro let me roll the regular damage first. Okay. Let me railroad this damage number for you because she's most certainly going to die, is what it's thinking. I mean, she's pretty uh, hurt. Yeah. No, I'm, <laughs> she's pretty hurting. 
She's beyond bloody right now. Oh, I said I didn't yeah, know that. so am I. Because you never asked. <laughs> it's okay. You're pumping all the spell slots. You already did. Yep. Let's see the damage. I am. <laughs> pumping. 15, because he gets all one. So what's the minimal amount of damage you can do? Okay. Uh, without <laughs> rolling any of your smite stuff. She's going to explode. <laughs> Just <laughs> so, <laughs> Without smite, minimum is 10 damage. The minimum? 10 magical piercing. Okay, no, nope, keep going. Okay. She's sure. bloodied. Bloody, bloody, bloody. Maybe. Nine. She might survive. We'll see. Bloody. All the spell slots. All of them. Let's go, ho. Nope, we're only doing what he said. <laughs> Thunder Smite and two level twos. He said three. Or, I thought he said, oh, three level twos? Okay. Either way. Uh, 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 <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, okay. I said add a thunder smite. So. Yes, you said thunder smite, three I'm level two, and your dragon. Okay. Uh, uh. Except for the fact that so what is that five d six plus um, your? Um, that's uh. it's no, it's a d six plus nine plus uh three d eight per um per spell slot. And is she at undead or fiend? Nope. Okay. So three six ninety eight. Where's the eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I got two. We're gonna have to look up thunder mm. smoke real quick. Two. 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 Yeah, you got a tutu? There's a picture of the tutu on Facebook. Are you about to be? I got tagged in it because someone took it off me. Alright, Thunder is my... <laughs> Why? Uh, it's 2d6 thunder damage. Why not? And they yeah, need a strength there, save. <laughs> Continue with the life, I apologize. <laughs> they need a strength save? Yep, got you, sorry. That is a nine. It was a fail. So she's going to be pushed ten feet and prone. Well, that means oh, she's in the water. Well, what? actually takes the damage. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Can the cat swim? Okay. Uh, I'm double checking the answer. she's floating. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, rolling... Uh, 63 magical yeah. damage. Yeah, she's dead. Okay. Well, she had 27 hit points left. Okay. And she, she's blasted yeah. into the water. She's blasted in the water. So as you do, so as this happens, so as you stab, and all of you see this, as except for Laura, as she stabs, um, or as, sorry, as Evan stabs her, her body just ejects off the boat. And as it does, it shrinks down from a were tiger to her tabaxi form, changing into a human female as she gets blasted off the boat, her hat falling to the water, and as her body hits the water, explodes and disappears. <laughs> oh. With the hat floating. So she wasn't even an actual tabaxi? As, no. <laughs> she's a humanoid shape changer. And her and her hat slowly floats down. And then lands next to the boat. And six seconds. Okay. No one's picking me up. <laughs> uh, I haven't had. That was my last turn. So if if we're out of combat, out of combat, I could do something. You yeah. There's six it. seconds. Yeah, I'm gonna do lay on hands five, right, healing. Okay. Mm -hmm. So Laura, you're stabilized. How many fails did she have? One. Oh no, she, she got. Oh yeah, she got hit while she was down. You got one save. You're welcome. I didn't do nothing. <laughs> I literally slept. <laughs> I literally slept. I woke up and I stayed down there, I guess. So, all right, but yes. So her body lays prone, and Evan, you watch her hat fall to the sea. Actually, scratch that. We're not gonna have. We're not gonna say that. The hat as because as it blows off, gets it gets put and knocked on the ship. And just kind of sits there on the ship. Right. A hat with a big floating feather on right. it. Can I pick it up? Yeah. Uh, 
Kitty there. How did you put it on? Ow! It doesn't fit over your helmet. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I don't put it on. Let's pick it up. Man. Okay. So as you look at it, it is a, it is a, it is what you consider to be a sailing hat. It has a big fluffy feather on it. Fluffy feathers. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around and look I'm at it. I'm gonna go ahead and use ten of my, uh, ten of my lay on hands on myself as well. I'm gonna turn around and look at our new companion that's dead. <laughs> like we knew you well as I put him in my net. Yeah, 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 so I'll help him. <laughs> <laughs> and then, bring him underwater. Um, can, <laughs> do I know he's dead? Uh, no, you would not know unless you. I'm gonna put him in my net. <laughs> you can do that net. Can I check a pulse? Bring him underwater. Yeah, you can check for a pulse. Okay, do I get a pulse? There is no pulse. I'll put yeah. the hat on his face. I cry. <laughs> He's in, net. Huh? he's in the net. Huh? He's in the net. What do you mean? He's in my net. <laughs> <laughs> he's in the net. What do you what mean? I said he's in my net like four times, Jordan. <laughs> okay, so he's in this. So he's in your net. Yeah, sorry. That's really close. <laughs> what? It's up to you. Ah, I'll let him make another one just because it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> I have to prep just in case. <laughs> <laughs> I just made everything too. Why is he in the net? Because he's dead. <laughs> and what do I do with people in the net? I drag them in the water. No, 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 no. Not yet. You haven't done it yet. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. Because I was about to be really sad. Okay. So I, yeah. So Kellogg is dead. Yes. My character cries because she just adopted him, um, and now her son's dead. Friend. However, <laughs> however, care for so all right, so so the her commander just... is kind of just leaning on Orion, or no? Did you set her down on the floor? No, I just I'm tired. <laughs> he put her in her in okay. her chair. Put her put her in her wheelchair. Okay, so <laughs> she sits, and she just kind of looks at all of you and goes, "I don't I don't know who to trust." I put the hat on her. I you're the captain now. <laughs> she was the captain. <laughs> I mean, oh. <laughs> you're the you're the official captain. <laughs> I don't I don't deserve this hat. This hat belonged to the former captain. I will take the hat off. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. No. I, I I am like, like I I I'm I'm piecing together what happened, but I'm not gonna put it on her. I'm just gonna hand it to her and like like help hold it out. Yeah, and she grabs it. Because I put it on her hat head without and permission. She goes, how dare you? I, don't, I don't deserve this hat. Through Evan. Through Evan? I realize what this means. We can take this ship. <laughs> we can own this ship. In front of her? <laughs> you can trust us! <laughs> I'm the captain now. <laughs> oh, you're like, you're <laughs> like, are you, are you hiding your face at all? No. <coughs> she sees who I am. She looks and goes, Boy! <laughs> <laughs> do I know you? I recognize you. Yes. I'm sure you do. It is about sailor. time I reintroduce myself. I'm Gohan. Hi. You know, <laughs> Gohan Steve. Can I walk over there? Yes. Yep. I'm the runaway. And the the person that's in the net, I can't <laughs> move because he's too, he's too fat. I can't you know move. when... Look up, my fat... Let me find his name real quick. You're being so freaking rude. What was your character's new character's name that just Kellogg. died? Kellogg. I put Kellogg in the net. And I told him, <laughs> as I'm doing that, I can't oh. lift him. I should have, and I say, you should have laid off the Frosted Flakes. You know. <laughs> and we're all like, what's Frosted Flakes? <laughs> when, what is Frosted Flakes? Captain, captain, because when he's, Captain Gary has died. Oh, I'm no, it's because he's a fur bulk and I'm a sea elf, so I'm tiny compared to him. Oh, yeah. Very oh. tiny. <laughs> I'm like five foot seven. All right. Shh. I'm five foot six. All right, we got, we got backstory plot going. Okay, sorry, sorry. You know, when Gary has died... He had only a few regrets in life. <laughs> I'm sure he did. He did what he did as a pirate. He didn't do good things. He owns those now. He understands what he did was not right. And he wishes he could change them, but he knows he cannot. But after being able to talk to him night after night... It's, he's changed. He's not the man that he used to be. And I believe that 
He would like to speak to you. He's gone for the remainder of the night. I won't see him again until the dawn at the helm. And you are more than welcome to join us there if you would like. Sure. Mm. I'll be here. And I think this hat should belong to you. Mm. He would want you to have it. She was gonna give it to you anyways, but you were gonna snatch it up and be like, fine! (laughs) There's something odd about the hat, though. Well, not really the hat, but the feather. The hat is more significant. Or or more. Not significant. What's the word I'm looking for? Special. No. Sentimental. There we go. It's more sentimental than anything, but the feather is what's really important with this hat. I will treasure it. Mm. Uh, She hands you the hat and goes, Mm. Well, I think think it's going to be off to bed and hopefully with the news of (laughs) Gracie dead, hopefully we can put the rest of this mutinous behavior behind us. Indeed. And we can run a legitimate business once again like old times I agree I and ha I put on that crap do I feel anything oh yes sir yes sir the presence yes, of God <laughs> this one <laughs> takes, this hat only <laughs> takes a minute to attune to cool you're just losing your mind. So like, oh, this is uh, just a normal hat. Whoa, oh. so, <laughs> so, as you, no, as you put on the hat, you you feel a very magical presence that just starts to overwhelm your brain. As the feather kind of starts to grow, um, I'll give you all the details. However, as this happens, um, you start to feel your head it, it glow. <laughs> And as it happens, a spiritual body appears in front of you. And it is the body and form of your fallen comrade, Kellogg. You can stay I died on the ship. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You did. You did indeed. A. What? Do you, does he see me <laughs> trying to pull him to the side of the ship? And yeah, then no, he's sitting no, he's right there and the see the dragon's body in his neck. <laughs> it's like, it's like murder house. We gotta move the body before he fully dies. I mean, you can't, you can't physically interact with this world, but you can definitely communicate, you can see, basically you are now a specter on the ship. Forever. That's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, so is the dragonborn that we just killed then? So is yeah, the... <laughs> his body shows up too. Oh, he's a little more peaceful but, now. But she's not on the ship. She's not on the ship. I blasted her to pieces. You also blew everything. Oh, yeah, uh, every, she's gone, gone. So that's a good thing. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah no. The dragonborn good. spirit Backward. also appears. I knew I would yeah, be able to communicate to you. Yeah, I'd say you've you've, you've you've come up, you've heard some hubbub. What's going on? We got a new ship! What? <laughs> yeah. Can okay. we just row? Oh, like, go. can this be our dean? Upgrades, people. I mean, you, you, can move, you can move the whole ship. You can have a fleet. No, this could have been ship. He can run scouting <laughs> missions for us. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's what we're gonna He's do. He's got a full crew. I was about to say, we're I'm about taking to go the dinghy through. with me. We know we had the dinghy. The on other the one boat, has dinghies. And then we put the boat as the dinghy. That's yep. not dinghy. His, that's not <laughs> there we go. That's how, that's how it's going. I can just go. Go. You <laughs> cannot put a bringing teen on the back of You <laughs> can drag it. We're going to tow that boat. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna, and it's going to tow that All right. Boat. Okay. I'm with you. All right. Yep. We're gonna look I should go to. Okay. So, yeah. So, you are now tugging a bringing. Okay. All right. Because we're going through ice, Andrew. See yeah. what I should do? Ice. We're going through ice. Yes. We're going through ice? Oh, we're way up high. No, 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 not yet. No, not no, yet. No, you know what I should do? Let's give me a little bit before you get to the ice. Oh, okay. I don't even know what? what location we were going after we... Because I wasn't here. The lighthouse. 
You're heading to the Coral Refuge. You are currently somewhere in the ocean about here. What's the Coral Refuge again? That's where his gods We're telling him to go. Told me to bring you no, we have had nothing better Come to bring bring go for. <laughs> so, it is roughly 3 a.m. in the middle of the night. Do I go back you know, to bed? You know what I should do? I'm still bleeding everywhere. I should open no, my your wounds are heal are closed up. You're not bleeding, Price but your clothes are definitely. I should open my basket shit behind Your clothes are definitely covered in blood, shit. but you're you're pretty <laughs> bruised up. Yeah, you're pretty. Yeah, you're bruised. So There's no fine. open wound. Because what's your max so HP? Because I gave you five. Sixty-four. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you're hurt pretty bad. <clears throat> oh crap! I have max fifteen. Sixty-four. I don't understand how. I don't know if I'm building my characters wrong. Mine's like sixty-four. I don't know them. Yeah. <laughs> as well as possibly I had 53 25 on 52 on here. mutineers on board as well. Do you have any cons? As well as the so 25 two. crew members from Plus yours. Two. Well, men, we've got a uh, quite the night ahead of us. Let's kill them all in their sleep. Exactly. <laughs> uh, <wait. laughs> I've never been more prepared to do a mission. Wait, we need pool. Last resources. Wait, we need okay. volunteers to be the first. Right, so I'm gonna let you guys discuss this right now while I get Caleb's uh, magic item sent to him. So yeah, all of you. Know, what's her name's magical sword? <laughs> What magical sword? Oh, no, she that was, was like summoning it. It got blown off the ship with her. It's sinking. <laughs> I died. <laughs> that makes sense. Serious? Okay. Okay. Well, I, I can't use it, so why would I grab it? Yeah, he can't you, use it. It's oh, metal. You can't attune to it? No, it's metal, metal. 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 I'm a druid. He's a druid. Evan still has a sword that he has no idea what it does yet. Yeah. I gotta find someone that can attune it for me. Or I'm right I'm here! To identify it. Yes! Yes, you are just down, though. That's probably uh, not your first priority. Let's get you healthy first. But it's you've an, had that sword cereal. for a whole lot longer. Just give it here. It's a green. I Take a nap. Drink water. Give it here. Be healthy. I'm a giant. Give me your sword. Oh, okay. Can she identify my sword? <laughs> yes, she can. Okay, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> That's quick. What is it? Do a memento. As I get Kayla's magical item, I will tell you. Uh, okay, so here you go. You ready? Yeah. So your sword, Sir Evan, mm. is a uh, is a it's a it's a plus one sword. Um, again, the hilt is um, emerald. Um, Hold so, on. Um, where is it? I don't know if you put it in your thing or not. I'm pretty sure I did. Let me check, is it on my level 6 paladin? I mean, it shouldn't have just transferred over when you leveled him up. It did not. Oh, dang. Because I did something stupid. So, okay. I got paid. What is it? So it's a plus one sword. And as, um, as you um, hold on to it, and you start to... Um, so she identifies it as a plus one sword. Short or long? Is a long sword, a plus one long sword, but um, you. But she. Al there's also a property of it that she's not a hundred percent sure about. Okay. The properties of. However, it does yeah. require the sword will require attunement. To figure out what the property is. Yep. Okay. I equip it. Okay. Well, it's gonna take an hour to to attune. No, it. I know. So I'm just. I'm so my javelin. I'm like. While it's yeah, on yeah. my back, it's not my primary weapon. So there you go, Caleb. It's awesome. There's your hat. <laughs> well, the feather, the, the feather, I should say, so not the hat. Two the hats now? He has the hat of disguise, and he has this feather, which can be transferred from hat to hat. So he can actually put the feather in the in the hat of disguise, and they because they're because the feather is a magic item, not the hat. Ah, <laughs> oh, I attuned to it already. Yeah, it's literally a one minute of two yeah. minutes for this legendary feather. I have to go there. Hmm. I was going to put a few days ago, but if I was interested in a pet, I should definitely get a raccoon. So, 
Do you want the I'm giant fat ass raccoon that we get in our trash can? No, I'm getting the one in our dumpster that's in the subway. Mm -hmm. You know that's illegal to own a pet raccoon in Missouri? <laughs> yeah. No, it's not. It is. It is? Wait, no, it it's is. not. One of the dudes from Walmart. <laughs> I know. It's it's not. It's, it's highly By common. law, it's illegal, it's illegal. because of compensation. Do I look like a law abiding citizen? I am one brain yes. away from being the threat of America. <laughs> so. <laughs> Okay, so you have oh. defeated Gracie. Oh jeez. I'll we'll we'll kind of expedite uh, this. You can all. I'm guessing you're all going downstairs. To murder she, people. The commander basically. Um, she says that you all can have. You basically, this is your ship now. You can. You will all gain the benefits of a long rest. Wow. Do some level up. Actually, I don't because I didn't do anything. You can all gain the benefits of a long rest. I did. Josh. <laughs> um, look at me. I'm full health still. And wow. you know what? We didn't take a break tonight, but I think that's a good ending point. It is and fantastic. that is where we will end this it's evening. It's beautiful. Hey. Go home. Got to be captain.